Day 15. Almost half a month. Hi, Kobobo. Can we get some yo's? Am I gonna beat the seventh gym today? Maybe. It depends on what type the gym is. Since the city's called Moss Deep, I assume it's gonna be grass type, but the city is an island city, so it might be water type. So I'm not sure. We'll see. Buenos star days? Hola. Hi, Kimori. Can we get some yo's? Hello. Uh. Oh, como si se it is so and so time? A las diez... Oh, no, no, no. A las once menos quince. Ahora. I think I said it right. It's 11 minus 15 minutes, so 10.45 right now. I'm learning. Wait, what if I do a span? Okay, I'm thinking about what stream I want to do. Menos cuarto. Dang it, I was close. Oh, yeah, that's right. It's menos... Damn, I was close! <laughs> I was on the right track. Shit. Because, like, I owe you guys a just chatting stream, and I said I would do it Wednesday. It's either going to be the Ards Spectrum quiz or a Spanish quiz. I think Spanish would be fun. It's mainly because I gotta have my sister take the Rads quiz first. And knowing her, I'm gonna have to do it with her. <laughs> So that'll be like two hours of my day. Also, last night, my sister and I watched, I think, four episodes of the new Fallout series. Guys, it's pretty good. Like, I'm not sponsored to say this, but it's pretty damn good. And I also have never played any of the Fallout games. I think I've seen like little bits and pieces of people play it throughout the years, but the TV series is pretty good. The quiz takes that long. Well, the quiz is 75, I think, multiple choice, but anytime my sister had to do, like, one of those state, like, quizzes, like the Wassel or the, oh, I forgot what it's called, but, like, the annual test, she would always have to get an extension, because she struggles with reading comprehension, so it would take her, like, Instead of 30 seconds on a question, it would take like one or two minutes, So, which is fine. It's just, because like I've skimmed through the RADS test. As I've also seen people like do it on stream too. And like some of the questions are like very weirdly worded. Face cam on in 30 seconds, hashtag real, hashtag not clickbait. Well, well, hi Vic. Can we get some yo's? Hello. I haven't even like done anything bad recently. Well, well, well. Okay, guys, I'm done posting. Make sure to go like my most recent tweet. That way everybody knows I am live. Live a little bit early. Three, two, one. Yo, I just heard a car outside. Anyway. Good morning. Good afternoon. Hope everyone is doing well today. Welcome in Kyobobo, Kimori, and Vic to the starting soon screen. Hello, everybody. Welcome in. Oh, I almost banned Kobobo. <laughs> I moved my mouse <laughs> by accident. Imagine... Imagine. I'm ordering food. What do you guys want? Um, I want a pizza. Pizza sounds good. Let's see. Yesterday, I did a sub on my stream. Oh, wait. 
I've taken like a four day break from Peace Lock because I was doing shit. I touched grass this weekend. Non subs, if you're watching this VOD, hello. Um, the past few days, I've been doing short sub only streams of picking berries, so we've added about four hours to the Peace Lock timer. But don't worry, I didn't lose any Pokemon. And also, no Pokemon involved, so editor, uh, just ignore the past four streams. Um, what else? Yeah, I touched grass this weekend. I went out and got food with my friend. We got hamburgers, and they were really good. And then, yeah, that's it. Yesterday and this morning, I've just been editing. I've been catching up on the Clips channel, because right now, I have YouTube shorts and TikToks for, like, I mean, they're the same video, but I, I need to start saying YouTube shorts more. I have clips and shorts for the next two weeks, so I can chill for a little bit. But yeah. That's what I've been doing the past few days. Today, the plan is simple. Peace luck, day 15. Guys, we're gonna do a YouTube intro, so you know the drill. Everybody say, hi, YouTube! Okay, I have to recap what we even did last time. Oh yeah, we defeated Team Magma, and then we're heading back to Aqua. Okay. Are you ready? Yeah. It is day 15, technically day 16 of the Peace Lock 2024. Last time, I defeated Team Magma and also got a bunch of Pokemon in the Safari Zone. So today, I finally can go back to the Team Aqua Base because I have the Orb now. And then hopefully, I have to defeat Team Aqua and then I can maybe go to Moss Deep City because they're blocking the path. So that is the plan for today. Maybe... Maybe I'll get to the seventh gym, but it all depends on the type. So we'll see. Also, over the past few days when I've been playing offline, but for sub only streams, I've collected so many berries. I have almost 20 of each berry now. So if you look at the actual footage, it'll say there's about four hour difference between the last time I did this. But don't worry, it was on the stream. Nothing bad happened. So, editor, you didn't miss anything. You can go back and watch the VODs, but honestly, they were very chill. So. I got Chick-fil-A, guys. Do we approve? That just means you're a self-hating gay, which is honestly normal. I haven't had Chick-fil-A in... Oh my god, I haven't had Chick-fil-A since I moved. And there's literally, like, a Chick-fil-A, like, so close to me now. But I just... I just can't justify going. Because in the city I live in now, Chick-fil-A, like, their menu prices are, like, a dollar more than my hometown. So I'm like, shit. I can never justify going to Chick-fil-A. There's also, like, so many other, like, better chicken spots. Like, I tried Jollibee's for the first time, like, a month ago. Holy shit. Their breading is so good. Well, today I have my chocolate protein shake. And also, I got a Popeye's even closer than the Chick-fil-A. So. Chick-fil-A ain't got shit on nobody else. Also, I feel like my camera is really bright today. Anyway. Let's jump into it. You've never had Popeyes? You gotta try it at some point, man. You gotta. You gotta. I think my favorite thing on the Chick-fil-A menu, though, is their, like, their icy shakes. Like, their frozen lemonades. Those are pretty good. Okay, we're in. We're in. Guys, get ready. Start the timer. We're in. Oh yeah, I'm back in Mallville City. So just to show you guys how many berries I got. Okay, some of them I have less than 10, but I have 33 Pekkas, 12 Rost, 21 Asperis, 45 Leopard Berries, which is actually huge, because at this point there's no way for me to buy items that restore PP in battle. Huge! I have 48 Orin Berries, one Parasim, because I planted some the other day. I have 45 citrus berries, so you know what? I think I am loaded and good to go when it comes to berries. So spending that extra four hours of the past few days was definitely worth it in my opinion. So we're gonna head back to Lily Cove and check out the Team Aqua Base. <laughs> when you defeat Pokemon, I'll get Popeyes. <laughs> Does she know? Does she know? <laughs> Don't worry, I- okay. The goal is to beat Peace Lock by my birthday, which is April 24th. 
Which is a little over a week away. I got nine days. Hey, I'm not planting any berries past today. Because I got a lot of berries. Ruh -roh. No! I hate electrics! They shock me! The paralysis is also really annoying. Easy. I'm out. I, I'm a head out. Wait. Oh, none of my Pokemon have fly. They're all in my box. Watch this. I know it's like such a hack to just overlevel your Pokemon, but it's so fun one hit KOing. It never gets old. Oh wait, also I forgot to tell you guys, new YouTube video, click the link, go watch it later. It is an edited highlight of my top stream clips. Wait, no, it's not tips, clips. No, wait, shit, I meant stream tips, not clips. I can't talk. The words are too similar. Go watch the video. If you watched it already, you're pretty cool. They changed my work shift, so I'm gonna be late to stream by about an hour. No! No! But that's okay. The only bad thing is that will be written on your performance review at the end of the year. Showing up late every day. SMH. But don't worry about it. VODs will always be up. At least I don't gotta wake up in the middle of the night anymore. Yeah. Honestly, I think night shift should be banned. Like, I understand the importance of it. Because, like, if nobody works at night, then you're not ready for the next day. But... It should just, like, not be necessary. It's also, like, really bad for, like, your mental health and shit. They should be paying, like... At least... Like, three dollars more for a night shift. Because I know my sister got, like, a dollar... Twenty-five more, but... It, like, fucked her up. Is this gonna be like a hundred part series on YouTube? No! No! <laughs> At most, I'll just have the editor edit down every day into one video. That's why like, I do an intro for every day. Oh wait, shit, the audition is scary. Why would I do this in a hundred part series? <laughs> like, one video per every hour? Dude, that'd be so- There's like sometimes hours in the peace lock where I literally don't talk. But that's because I'm grinding. So it'd be like a 20-part series? Yeah, basically. I feel like that makes the most sense, like a part per day. Because I'm thinking about like how like I want the edits for these streams to go. Like I think I want to keep- obviously keep in the gym battles. And then probably keep in most of the encounter- or the, the trainer battles. And then also like splice in an order. Um, like, any time I, like, goof and gaff with chat, or, like, do more commentary stuff. But, hopefully, <laughs> I'm not gonna touch the Peace Lock streams in the editing bay for me for a long-ass time. I ain't gonna touch it. I just hope in, like, the next six months to a year I can afford an editor. That way they can do it. <laughs> I don't wanna do this shit. Who wants to take the hit and be the main channel editor? I mean, the gaming channel editor. That's a lot of hours. Yeah, man, like... Because usually for editing, you multiply the base raw footage hours by three, and that's usually about how long it takes for, like, a simple edit. 
So, if there's like 100 plus hours of footage, that's 300 hours of probably estimated editing time. That's like 8 to 10 weeks to get this whole series done. That's like a whole quarter. <laughs> that's crazy! <laughs> I'll use CapCut? No! It's so cringe. Whenever I see a TikTok end and then it has like the little CapCut animation. It's so cringe. Obviously, if I have an editor, I will gladly pay for your software. Because then it would be a business expense. And that's pretty cool. I can write it off on my taxes. But no. Like, depending on what type of work whether it be contract or, um, like a full-time hourly employee. If you're a contracted worker- wait, glue! Hmm. If you're a contracted worker, your employer or the person who pays you is not required to, like, pay for, like, your, your equipment, your software. Because if you're an independent contractor, it's your responsibility to provide the service. And you have to do everything in your power to do the service yourself. <clears throat> like, it's kind of- like, imagine like you're a construction worker. Usually you'll charge the client, like, for the wood and the nails, but you're not going to charge the client for, like, the- the tools and the saws. Because the tools and the saws is something that you, the contractor, should, like, have already. And, like, those are probably your tools. Okay, we're going to Lily Cove. We're almost there. Come on. Ooh, a shop it. We're gonna kill it. I mean... Okay, I keep on saying I need to stop saying kill or die. Like, I genuinely need to, like, tone it down. I know I say that all the time, but I just, I just don't know what other word to put in. Like, saying, like, oh, I need him to faint is not as fun. Hi, Ryan. Can we get some yo's? Hello. Come on, we're so close to the city. Yeah, another sunflower badge chatter. So many of you guys have been watching for so long. Like, a sunflower badge is, like, the normal now. I was thinking about it this morning when I was editing. Because I was editing, I think, my first Animal Crossing stream after I moved to this new unit. So it has, like, the Christmas tree. I got the Pikachu on my chair still. I'm like, shit, that doesn't feel like a year ago. Okay, we're back in Lily Cove City. On to Team Aqua's base. Wait, I gotta check my team. Because I assume for this Team Aqua area, there's gonna be fights. So I'm gonna swap out Linus and Snazzy for other Pokemon. Like, some of you guys have been watching for so long. And then I'm also thinking to myself, like, I've been streaming for so long as well. Like, three years is such a huge part of your life. Like, that's high school, you know what I mean? It's like a whole era. Okay, obviously, Gyarados stays. Blaziken stays. Gardevoir stays. We'll keep Nuzli for the XP share. I want Torkoal. I mean, I don't think... Team Aqua's obviously gonna have water type. Oh wait, I should bring a grass type. What am I doing? Tropius? Oh yeah, they got Razor Leaf. Let's see what moves this new Graveler has. 
They have rock throw, magnitude, self destruct, <laughs> wait, and roll out. <laughs> wait, why does he have self destruct? Uh... <laughs> I have to make sure I don't accidentally click this, so I'm swapping the position. Imagine. I guess we could bring Graveler. No, wait, no, 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 no. They're gonna have water type. It'd be dumb to bring Graveler. Pelipper's fly is pretty strong. I'll bring him. Wait, no, 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 no. I think Aaron is, like, level 32? 38, holy shit. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll bring Aaron. I always forget. He's kind of like my sleeper Pokemon. I always forget. Hi, Electro. Can we get some yo's? Hello. I'll make Ralph the party leader, and then Magikarp second position. Because I'm only going to use Blaziken if there's any dark type, but I assume Aqua's going to be dark and water, so I'm probably not going to use Blaziken. Aaron, water's neither weak nor strong against steel, so he's fine. But Aaron is pretty damn strong. Or maybe... You know what? I need to level up Aaron. So I'll make Aaron my number two position. That was a misclick. Wait, I should. You know what? I'm gonna give my team berries. Okay, I'm ready. Time to go to the Team Aqua Base. Yeah, the whale lords are still here. We're in. Oh, they're looking at me now. What? What do you want with Team Aqua? Our boss isn't here. He's gone off to Jack of Submarine. Wait, where did he go? <laughs> do you really think I'd tell you something that crucial? Off to Sleepport City. Oh, really? Stupid story mission. Oops, I pressed the wrong button. All the way back here? Oh, come on. Imagine being a level 17 tentacle. Wait, don't I have Pelipper on my team? I don't. Man, I can't fly. Well, off to Slateport City I go.
At least I can pick more berries. I know this is looking aw an awful like the berry runs, but don't worry, I am progressing. It's 11.14, make a late 11 level wish. I missed it. Also guys, we're 30 minutes into the stream, so if you need her, click that follow button. You get cool emotes and you get to dive in chat. Isn't that pretty cool? Watch this. Easy. That'll happen to you if you don't follow. <laughs> You'll just be confused. If I would have known I had to get a 
If I would have known I had to go to sleep for City, I could have just looped around here. Pokemon! I can't even take two steps! All these level 13s just want to get fucked up. Wow, you did two damage. Take the L. <laughs> the last single patch of grass. Almost in Slaveport. Here we are, back in Slaveport City. Oh! Big drama. Okay, I'll, I'll get off my bike to be respectful. I don't want to be the infamous clip where the cyclist runs into the reporter. I don't think that'd be a good look for me. Captain Stern. Yes, indeed. We intend to move ahead with our exploration. That's wonderful, Captain Stern. Thank you for taking the time from your busy schedule to talk to us. We hope we can interview again with news of more discoveries. Whew. That was my first time to be filmed for TV. That was nerve-wracking. Oh, Pearson, you're looking great. We made a huge discovery on our last seafloor exploration. We found an underwater cavern on Route 128. We think it's the habitat of a Pokemon that's said to have been long extinct. <laughs> oh, wait, that's the enemy. <laughs> Captain Stern, I presume. We of Team Aqua will assume control of your submarine. Your objections are meaningless. We expect your total cooperation. Just watch and learn what Team Aqua's plan. What was that all about? It sounded like someone using a megaphone. Where did it come from? It's from the harbor! The submarine, they're trying to take it! Peason, please, come with me! Oh, not you again! You are tenacious to track us here, that much I will give you. But now, no one can stop us, no one! Or, will you follow us back to our hideout in Lily Cove City? <laughs> no, they got away! 
Why? Why would Team Aqua steal my submarine Explorer 1? They can't be after the slumbering Pokemon at the bottom of the sea. But even if I were to chase them, I don't stand a chance against them. Put me in, coach! Put me in! I'll jump in the water right now! Okay. Wait, I came all the way here? And they're like, oh, you better meet us at our hideout. I have to go all the way back to Lily Cove? That's so annoying. They said there's a secret passageway in 128. Oh, that's all the way down here. Wait, Copian can probably fly. They have Razor Leaf, Stomp, Sweet Scent, and Whirlwind. You know what? I'll teach him fly, because fly, I want another offensive move anyway, so... I'll do that. I don't want to backtrack all the way back again. And I'm probably not going to use him for... I'm probably not going to use Tropius for the final six anyway, so... Razor Leaf, I'm keeping. Stomp, I'm keeping. Sweet Scent, allures the foe to reduce evasiveness, and maybe. Whirlwind, blows away the foe with wind and ends the battle. That's stupid. I don't think you can even use that for like a normal trainer battle. Copium, learn fly. Okay, let's see how fly works. Fly to Lily Cove. Oh wait, that's so cool. Oh, and he even goes back in the Pokeball. Aw, that's cute. That was quick. And I do really appreciate how Fly has offensive move capabilities as well. It's honestly a huge dub. Said he'll just let me beat up the enemies. And we're in. Back to the Aqua Hideout. The grunts are gone. We're in. Oh. <laughs> he didn't see me. Oh, no, I, no, I, not a key. Nobody there. I'm so good at stealth. I also can't run inside. I guess I should fight him. Here, look, we'll jump scare him, look. Boo! <laughs> ah, suspicious character spotted! Team Aqua Grant would like to battle. They sent it to Poochiana. Of course, my greatest weakness. A Poochiana. Okay, so it seems like these enemies are gonna be like level 30, 30 to 35, and then the final is probably gonna be like 35 to 40. So I think I'm gonna give Ralph a the golden amulet. So 
switching in for Blaziken, because Blaziken can fight. I mean, he can fight, but he has a fighting type move. You defeated Team Aqua Grunt. Yeah, I lost it. You got 640 Poké Dollars for winning. I took a loss for the team, but I did my job. We continue on. Oh no. I hate these mechanics. Ooh, Secreto. You found one max elixir. The only thing I don't like about the teleportation mechanic is that it's so easy to get lost. Okay, there's no double battle, so I'll just talk to her. Yawn! Keeping watch over the Hana bores me. I'll take you on. Was she flirting? Team Aquagrant would like to battle. They sent out a Carvana. Another dark time? Bruh. Maybe, maybe it should have Aerith for number one. Number one Q. Because the dark type didn't affect Skarmory at all. Which is Steel. Hmm. The rough skin was super effective. No, that can't be right. The fighting move is effective against Carvana. Donnie grew to level 31. Let's go! Donnie's trying to learn Faint Attack. Faint Attack is a dark move, so let's see what that is. Draws the foe close, then strikes without fail. Ooh, guaranteed 60 HP? Or 60 power? Yo! Yeah, I can't forget Flash. That's honestly a huge L. I think there is one character in the world that can make you forget a move. But for now, I'll swap out Nature Power, because I think Nature Power is kind of D.U.M. Dottie learned Faint Attack. You defeated Team Aqua Grunt. Yawn! Oh, I lost. You got 1,280 Pokedollies for winning. I can- Oh, That's a double battle. I should heal Blaziken. I kinda wanna try Aaron as the party leader. But I'll- I'll keep him still holding the bear because he's only level 38. And I'll give Blaziken... ...the amulet coin. Hey, you there! Which do you think is cooler? Team Aqua's uniform or Team Magma's? 
I'll be honest, Team Magmas, because I like red. And red is more evil. Team Aquagrad would like to battle the Ascendant of Poochiana, level 31. Okay. So if Poochiana tries a dark move, I think it has no effect on Erend. Iron Tail is steel, but it lowers my defense. Headbutt, strength is normal. I'll try Iron Tail. Okay, so steel is neither strong nor weak against dark. Team Aquagrant is about to use Zubat. Will I change? Zubat is dark flying. No, poison flying, sorry. That means Ralph is strong. I kind of want to see how Steel type does against Zubat. Okay, Steel is neither strong nor weak against Zubat. You defeated Team Aqua Grunt. I lost in a cool way. You got 620 Pokedollies for winning. Okay, so it seems like Aaron is pretty strong on his own. So we're gonna give Aaron the amulet coin. Continue on. If you want to know the secret about our hideout, you have to beat me. Which will be easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Team Aqua Grant would like to battle. They sent out a Zubat, level 31. Now, surely a normal move isn't crazy, but we'll see. Yeah, normal is neither strong nor weak against psychic or flying. Makes sense. Team Aqua Grunt is about to use Carvana. Will I change? No. Because water is not... is neither weak nor strong against steel. Wait. Iron Tail is not effective against Carvana. Carvana is dark water. Is water strong against steel? You defeated Team Aqua Grunt. I can't win at all. You got 1,240 Poké Dollars for winning. I had a secret? Well, let's just say there's a submarine at the far end. But, by now... <laughs> okay, so the one to the far left is probably a portal. To the submarine. I'm going back. Oh, no! <laughs> oh, wait, what the hell? Got it, don't worry. Yo, Segreto! Ain't no way. No! Level 30 Electrode.
Oh no. Electrode could just explode. I don't have any ground types. I should have grabbed some. I'm gonna try and run. I can't escape. No, don't! Holy shit, it's not effective. Thank god, thank god, thank god. Holy fuck. Okay. I got so lucky. Wild Electrode fainted. What type is self-destruct? This is not effective against Erend. Maybe it's an electric? No, it can't be electric type move. It has to be normal, because Saw had it. Man, I got so lucky. Okay, so I guess if it's another Voltorb, we'll just fight it. Whew. Lucky. Man, so lucky! I guess these just explode. You found one Master Ball. Thank you! You found one Nugget. Okay, I got very lucky that I had Erend as my number one Q there. That could have been very bad. Let's get out of here. We continue on. Oh! You didn't see me, sir. Oh! Okay, you did see me. <laughs> I grew weary of waiting. You owe me a battle, too. Team Aqua Grant would like to battle. They sent out a Carvana. Level 32. Okay, so the Steel type move was not effective. You defeated Team Aqua Grant. Tired of waiting, lost and dazed. You got 1,280 Poké Dollars for winning. Boss, is this good enough? I don't think so. You took a major L right there, man. Ooh, Secreto. You found one Nest Ball. I do really appreciate how most every single new room has a path that leads to a secret and then progress. Keeps it fairly simple. Oh! He's gonna see me, isn't he? Feel supply loaded, A-OK, -okay, and crew snacks loaded, A-OK. -okay. Nothing left to do but kill a pesky meddler. More like, I'm gonna KO you. <laughs> Team Aqua Grant would like to battle. They sent out a Zubat, level 32. Now, Zubat was neither strong nor weak against Steel, so we're just gonna do Strength. One hit KO, easy. Yes, sir? You defeated Team Aqua Grunt. I took a serious licking. You got 1,280 Poké Dollars for winning. Hm. This was supposed to happen. My mission was just to hold you up. 
the main reason why I want to use Aaron for these fights is so I can get to know which types is better against Steel or weak against Steel. And then also for the Moss Deep Gym, my Pokemon have to be 41 to 42. And right now, Magikarp is 42, Ralph 41, and Blaziken 46. So these three, they're ready for the Moss Deep Gym if I have to use them. So I'm just building up Aaron right now. Hopefully I can get the final evolution soon. Smile. I don't want to do a double battle, they're scary. When I joined Team Aqua, the first thing I had to learn was how these warp panels connected. Yeah, they are pretty confusing. Not too bad, honestly. Team Aqua Grant would like to battle. They ascended a Carvana, level 32. Easy. You defeated Team Aqua Grunt. I was too occupied thinking about the warp panels. You got 1,280 Poker Dollars for winning. Warp panels, the hideout's pride and joy. You're clueless about where you are, aren't you? Fluster and tire out the enemy, then lower the boom. Fluster and tire out the enemy, then lower the boom. That's our plan. Well, it's not working out too well for y'all so far. Team Aqua Grant would like to battle. They sent out a Zubat, level 32. You defeated Team Aqua Grunt. What's wrong with you? You're not tired at all. We got 1,280 Pokedollies for winning. Oh! Oh, he turned around. Okay, I see now. Dodged! Oh wait, that's the start. No, it's not. Wait, what? No, I'm going back. I'll fight this guy. No! That was the start. Ain't no way. They were punishing me for exploring. Well, you know what? I'll get back to the main mission after the break, because, guys, we are an hour in a stream, so it's time for me to run some ads. So you can avoid that ad by subscribing for $4.99, just $5. Skip your coffee and get ad free viewing all month long. Or you can link Amazon Prime to your Twitch and hashtag sub for free or prime. Click subscribe, see if you have a subscription available. And if you subscribe, you can kill my Pokemon. So don't subscribe. Get some water, get a snack. I'll see some of you guys in a few. Okay, that wasn't too bad to get back to. <laughs> Got here already, did you? We underestimated you, but this is it. I'm a cut above the grunts you've seen so far. I'm not stalling for time. I'm gonna pulverize you. <laughs> Ooh. Oh my god, for free? Holy moly. Aqua Admin Matt would like to battle. They sent out a Mighty Anna, level 34. My attack fell. Uh oh. You know what I'm doing, Blaziken? You're in. I'm not playing around. That's so bad. I'm confused. Don't hit yourself, please. 
<gasps> thank you, thank you. I love you, Blaziken. Dottie grew to level 32. Let's go. Aqua Admin Matt is about to use Gobat. Will I change? Yes. Ralph is in. Psychic. Easy. And you thought you were the best of your grunts? <laughs> you defeated Aqua Admin Matt. Ah, so I lost too. You got 2,720 Pokedollars for winning. To think you only had two Pokemon. <laughs> well, I was toying with you, our boss got through his preparations. <laughs> our boss has already gone on his way to some cave under the sea. If we're gonna give chase, you better search the big wide sea beyond Lilico. But will you find it then? <laughs> no! They got away. How good they. At least I can finally go in the water now. Oh, I can't jump from here. Makes sense. That would be a scary jump. I'm gonna go to the Pokemon Center and heal, and then probably also rearrange my party a little bit, because it seems like I don't need the grass type. Yeah, I should be fine with Aaron, Ralph, Magikarp, and Blaziken. You know what? I'll hold on to Copium, because Copium is fly. That way, if I need to fast travel, I'll have him. I don't need to rearrange the party. Oh, the grunt's gone. Nice. We can finally progress on into the ocean. In the trainer battles. I'll have Magikarp as the leader and Ralph as number two. Yeah, let's get to fighting. I'm growing bored of swimming. How about a battle? Swimmer Grace would like to battle. They sent out a Meryl, level 34. Finally, the Pokemon are increasing in level. <laughs> Water gun? Imagine. A crit only doing 5 damage? Crazy. You defeated Swimmer Grace. 
I had no idea that you were this strong. You got 544 polka dollars for winning. Well, that would have been a double battle if I had gone through. Here I am swimming by my lonesome on this wide, beautiful sea. There's no other word for it. This is pathetic. <laughs> what? Isn't the sea beautiful, though? This kid is, like, too philosophical for their age. Swimmer Declan would like to battle the Centaur of Gyarados. Wait. Hey, what is this? <laughs> we both have Intimidate. <laughs> okay. Um... A crit? Yo! Oh yeah, Twister can cause flinching! I forgot! He looked at me. Easy. You defeated Swimmer Declan. I'm feeling blue. Blue is the sky. You got 544 Polka Dollars for winning. I continue on. Tentacool, level 22. No, not Poison Sting! Thank you for not poisoning me. Thank you. This ocean is huge! Oh, he got me! Hey, are you lost at sea? If you could be my Pokémon, I could serve as your pilot! That's such like a little kid thing to say. <laughs> He's like, yeah, I'm a pilot. Swimmer Spencer would like to battle. They sent out a tentacle, level 33. Thank you for not poisoning. Very kind. Swimmer Spencer is about to use a wingle. Will I change? No. You defeated Swimmer Spencer. I lost my bearings in battle. You got 528 Poké Dollars for winning. I'm gonna heal Magikar. This ocean is huge. Oh, double battle. Go. Level 13 Wingle. <laughs> Imagine.
This looks awfully suspicious. So wrap still works even if it flinched. Dottie grew to level 33. Let's go. Magikarp is kind of getting cooked a little bit by these encounters. Probably because I'm going into this area with no, like, explicit type advantage. Okay, this is for sure a double battle. Yeah, I'm fine with Ralph going in. My big sister is tough at Pokemon! Don't cry when you lose! No, you'll be crying, kid. Sis and bro Lily. Sis and bro Lila and Roy would like to battle. They sent out a Chinchou and a Carvana. Carvana is dark. Their attacks were lowered though. Okay. I'm debating if I want to swap out Ralph. Because I don't want to lose him. Magikarp has to do a hit. Oh, Twister affects both Pokemon. Okay. My safest bet, because Erend is Steel Dark. I don't know if Erend has a type advantage here. Because Iron was not a strong move. Mm -mm. I could do Copium, but they're only level 27. But they have 97 HP. And I don't think Dark was effective against Flying or Grass. And Copium does have fly, so they can just go off the board. I'll do Copium. I'm cooking a little bit here. My defense is lower. So Magikarp should still keep doing Twister. Copium is going to fly. Or maybe Razor Leaf. 
I'll try Razor Leaf. Wait, Razor Leaf affects both? It does! Wait, that's cool! Okay, Copium was the way to go. I don't know what type Chinchou is, I think... Wait, Chinchou is electric! I forgot. You know what, Ralph is going back in. I forgot. I was like, why is it yellow? <laughs> and it's psychic? What? Wait, that's crazy. You know what, teleport. I want to see what teleport does. Oh, Ralph is still confused. Lamau. <laughs> okay, Copium kind of came in clutch for that, for that battle. You defeated Sis and Bro Lila and Roy. Uh oh, my big sister will chew me out. We got 1,584 Pokemon dollars for winning. Will you battle us again? But take it easy next time, okay? I ain't ever fighting y'all again. I don't want another double battle. Looks like something should be here. Pokeball. Come on, let me in. Let me in! Really? They're just teasing me like that. Land? No, <laughs> let me go on land, please. Nothing's here. I'm gonna check my map. Oh, I'm heading towards Moss Deep. Okay. If you just float in the sea like this, Pokemon come around to play. Swimmer Jenny would like to battle the Ascent of Whalmer, level 34.
for fun, surf. <laughs> you defeated Swimmer Jenny. Oh darn, I've gone and lost. You got 544 Poké Dollars for winning. It's only a whim, but maybe I'll get you to register me on my Pokénav. I was just here. What? Trying to be stealthy. A level 27 wingle. Not too bad. I am stealth. I'm not gonna lose to some surfer trainer. Easy dodge with the double battle. Triathlete Isabella would like to battle. They sent out a Staryu, level 34. Staryu is normal water. Cause swift is a normal move. You defeated triathlete Isabella. I've only got some sweat in my eyes. I'm not crying. You got 2,720 Poké Dollars for winning. I'm gonna give Magikarp a berry, cause they're running low on PP. You're riding a Pokemon instead of swimming yourself? I'm envious. Swimmer Roland would like to battle. They sent her to Carvana level 34. Magikar grew to level 43. You defeated Swimmer Roland. Ah, I can't! You got 544 Pokemon Dollars for winning.
I wonder if a, swir a surf will take him out. Surely. Okay, cool. <laughs> Ooh, a level 34 tentacle. Tentacles are kind of annoying because the higher level ones have wrap and constrict. I kind of want to just, like, run away. Not worth it. Oh, back on land. <laughs> I dive deep underwater to go deep under cover. Plumbing the depths is where I excel. That's one way to put it. Swimmer Chad would like to battle. <laughs> He's not that a level 33 tentacle. He's such a Chad. Swimmer Chad is about to use a whale mirror. Will I change? No. It flinched again? Man, I'm so lucky. Surf, cause screw you. Dottie grew to level 34. Let's go. You defeated Swimmer Chat. Blub, blub, blub. I'm shaking. <laughs> you got 520 Poké Dollars for winning. <laughs> oh, it's Talia. I was just thinking I'm getting aboard of the abandoned ship. But since I'm already here, I want to beat you once. I'll be sticking around a bit more. If you feel compelled, why don't you come see me? I think today will be the day that I finally challenge the man next door to a match. Be seeing you. What is this? Hunter's house. Surely you won't hunt me. I'm the diving treasure hunter. I'm the awesome dude who makes deep sea dives together treasures resting at the bottom. You haven't gotten any treasures for me. If you see any shards, like the red shard, you have to trade it with me. Okay. Thank you for not hunting me. Also, thank you to those who follow the channel, because guys, we are another 30 minutes in the stream, so if you're new here, click that follow button. You get cool emotes, and you get to type in chat. Isn't that pretty cool? Hell yeah. Moss Deep City. Ooh. I want to see if there's any more trainer battles first. This guy? Oh, he just keeps swimming. Okay. We made it to Moss Deep City. That's cool how it's partially underwater, too. Don't tell me these are all trainer battles. I can't do this anymore! It's utterly hopeless! I'm a fighting-type trainer, but I can't win at the Moss Deep Gym no matter how hard I try! 
Oh, punch, 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 punch. What? Don't look at me that way. I'm only hitting the ground. Or do you want me to teach your Pokemon dynamic punch? I'm not now, man. Darn. You ever making fun of me? Punch, punch, punch. <laughs> yeah, don't assault the child. Is this gym a psychic type? Ooh. Ah, it feels great letting the waves wash over my feet. Speaking of the waves, you know the island city, Sutopolis? I think the gym there had a new leader come in. People tell me the new leader once mentioned Wallace. I don't remember Wallace. What is this building? Oh, hello. I can explain game rules to you if you'd like. Which game should I describe? Pokemon Jump. Pokemon Jump. Make your Pokemon skip the Vine Whip rope with the A button. Only many Pokemon around 28 inches or less may participate. Pokemon that only swim, burrow, and fly are not good at jumping. As a result, those Pokemon may not participate. Good things happen if everyone jumps in time. Hi, uh, welcome. Are you here to play games using wireless communication? The wireless adapter isn't connected. Come back when it's hooked up, child. These are online games? Come on! I don't have the right cables for my GBA. Ah. That probably was like a Mario Party minigame. Okay, the city's huge. All life needs the sea to live, even though it makes its home on the land. Life, having run its course, becomes soil and returns to the land. And the sea is always connected to the land. Yes, like the very shoreline here. Thanks, Gramps. You found one netball. Oh, it's the playground man. Hey, peace and feeling good? I'm doing great. I heard Moss Deep's gym leader is pretty strong, so I decided to come take a look-see for myself. But there's something wrong about this town. People are going on about a warning letter in the Space Center. I don't think it concerns me in any way, though. Hmm. Peace, I too? Hmm. My little sister exchanges mail with her boyfriend in Fortree. I don't envy her one bit at all. Okay, why do you have a boyfriend? I think you're way too young. Even though I can't see my friend in Fortree, my Pokemon carries mail back and forth for us. I'm not lonesome even though we're apart. Okay, it's her friend. I know everybody else had a friend in elementary. Okay, this island is kind of huge. This rock has a special meaning to the people at the Space Center. They put it here as their wish for their rockets to fly safely. When you make a wish, what do you use? Do you wish upon a star? I use a wish tag to make it happen. That's what I do. Wouldn't it be nice if the whole world was covered in plants and flowers like this island? Hippie? <laughs> Hey there, trainer. A super rod really is super. Say all you want, but this baby can catch Pokemon off the seafloor. What do you think? You want it, don't you? Yes! You bet, you bet. After all, a super rod is really super. You obtained the super rod. Finally, we can catch more Pokemon. If there's any water, try dropping any rod and see what bites. Finally. A voyage on a ship is fine, but crossing the sea with Pokemon using Surf... Now that's an exhilarating trip. Wouldn't you agree, youngster? I do agree, Grandpa. I mean, Pa. <laughs> You're way too young to be a Grandpa. I'll explore to the right in a bit. I want to explore the main city. Let's see what they got for sale here. Netball. Works well on water and bug type. I think I have a few of those. Dive ball. I want to get a few of these.
Yeah, everything else I can just get at the super mall. Revive is fantastic. Give it to a fainted Pokemon or the Pokemon will arise. But be careful. Revive doesn't restore the used PP and moves. The Nut and Dive Balls are rare Pokeballs that, only, that are only made of Moss Deep. A Nut Ball is effective against Bug and Water-type Pokemon. A Dive Ball works best on Pokemon at the bottom of the sea. Max Repel keeps all weak Pokemon away. Out of all the Repel sprays, it lasts the longest. Around Moss Deep, you can see Wild Wilmer. It's called, um, what was it now? Wait, wait, wait for watching. Oh, so cute. Depending on the special abilities of Pokemon, some moves might change or not work at all. The gym leaders in this town are a formidable duo. Leaders? No, don't tell me it's a double battle. No. Their combination attacks are like excellent and wow. Oh no. No, I hate double battles. They're scary. My little brother says he likes to go find people's secret bases. Yeah, he's a little snoop. You should make a secret base somewhere. I'll go find it. No, I won't. I don't like snoopers. Or Snoopy. I think Snoopy's lame. I'll say it. I got this from Steven, but I don't know what it's good for. I think it's called King's Rock. Do you want it? Yeah! Why would you want it? You're weird. You can keep it, but keep it a secret from Steven. You obtained the King's Rock. Okay, who's Steven? King's Rock. A hold item that may cause flinching when the foe is hit. Ooh, that's huge! Wait, that's actually huge. That means even non-dark type moves can flinch. That's crazy. Thank you, kid. Ooh, should I cop these rocks? It's a collection of rare rocks and stones assembled by Steven. I should not cop them. I'll be nice. Hmm. We are Gyarados. It likes yellow Pokeblocks, doesn't it? No, I'm positive of it. It definitely likes yellow Pokeblocks. My husband can tell what kind of Pokeblock a Pokemon likes at a glance. Okay, that's cool, but I don't need that. The Island Space Center has been launching huge rockets. There's been some kind of an uproar over a letter they received recently. Drama? I heard from a sailor buddy that Team Aqua set up a shop in Lily Cove. I also heard that someone came along and wiped the floor with him. Moss Deep's here been targeted by that Team Magma. If you want to know what they're up to, go visit the Space Center. The whole talk of the town. That's me. Moss Deep City Pokemon Gym Leaders. Liza and Tate. The Mystic Combination. Mystic. Okay. Wait, it's either Psychic? It's either Psychic or Ghost, because if the fighting type has no effect, obviously physical moves don't have an effect on Ghost type. And then also Psychic doesn't work either. Wait, no, sorry. Fighting is not effective against... Psychic is not effective against... Um... No. Yeah, fighting is not effective against Psychic. 
They've got to be ghost type. I'm going to walk in just to chit chat. Yo, how's it going, Champion Bound Peason? The gym leaders here use psychic type Pokemon. Okay, he snitched. If you go up against them with fighting or poison type Pokemon, they'll inflict horrible damage. Plus, they'll come at you with outstanding combination attacks. If you want to win, you'll need to show how tight you are with your Pokemon. Go for it. Okay, so psychic. So that means I need a full dark Pokemon build. Which, oh, I'm gonna have to level up so many Pokemon? Shit! Mainly because, like, my primary party build right now is Psychic and Fighting. So I cannot, I cannot bring Blaziken at all. Magikar can probably go, because they have Bite. Ralph. Ralph could tank, but probably not a good idea. Ooh. Okay, so I for sure- I can only bring dark Pokemon to this gym. Yeah, only dark type. Ooh, we're gonna have to do a lot of leveling up today, guys. Let's check out the Space Center, though. Ooh, or maybe ghost Pokemon, too! Because the second- Ooh, I can- I can make a ghost dark build. Maybe? Anyway, to the space center. I was taking a stroll down the beach when I found this. It's not anything I need, so you can have it. You obtained the sunstone. Cool. The Hoenn region has been famous for its meteor showers for a long time. Thank you, sir. Some people claim that Pokemon came from space. Could that be true? It's gotta be. I think this is Steven. Yeah. Peason, have you read that proclamation already? Team Magma is coming after the rocket fuel on this island. I don't know what they need for it, but they can't be allowed to take it. I'll keep an eye on things for a while longer. In the meantime, why don't you go check out the town? A rocket launch demands perfection. Not even a 1% margin of error is allowed. Even if it's 99%, okay, the whole thing is useless if 1% happens to be no good. Despite that, we never stop trying. Why? It's a dream that never ends. The rocket launched safely. That's successful launch number three. A giant chunk of metal bursts through the skies and flies into space. It boggles my mind. <laughs> Classic boomer. I wish ordinary people could go into space one day. If only I was a little younger, I would have liked being an astronaut. No, it's not too late. I can and I will try. Moss Deep has mainly sunny weather, and its winds are stable. It's an ideal location for launching rockets. Oh, it's total? Where's the Team Magma proclamation? I totally missed that. Oh, it's on the table. This is an intent to steal notice. To the staff of the Space Center, how are you? We are doing fine. We will soon visit you to take your rocket fuel. Please don't try to stop us. We'll take the fuel no matter what. Let there be more land. Team Magma. Don't worry, I'll stop those fiends. They're probably going to spawn after I beat the gym battle. So. Hmm. I guess that means I got to get to leveling. I gotta figure out which Pokemon I wanna bring now. I don't know 
wood is strong against poison. But I assume ghost or dark. So for dark slash ghost Pokemon, I have an Absol, Mightyena, Duskull, and Shuppet. So that's probably the ones I need to level up for this gym. And then I can also probably bring, bring Gyarados. Maybe Erend as an XP share Pokemon. Because Nuzleaf, even though they have the Aura Grass Dark move, okay. They are a Grass and Dark type Pokemon. Okay, party for this upcoming gym. Gyarados. Nuzleaf. Absol, Mightyena, Shuppet, or Duskull. So for this gym, my Pokemon need to be level 41. So I think for the rest of the stream, I'm going to be leveling. Um, yeah, let's get to rearranging. For sure gonna bring Mightyena, because they- this Mightyena has the Intimidate trait. Absol would be kind of cool to battle with. I haven't battled with Absol at all. Man, this looks like a very dark team. So we got Gyarados level 43, Mighty Anna 25, Absol 25, Nuzleaf 34, Shuppet 28, and Duskull 29. Mighty Anna has Bite, Sand Attack, Order Sleuth, and Roar. Absol has Taunt, Bite, Razor Wind, and Quick Attack. Shuppet has Screech, Nightshade. Ooh, Nightshade! Inflicts damage identical to the user's level. Ooh, that's kinda cool, so that's probably like a guaranteed 40 hit, because this, this gym is level 40. Curse and Spite. Spite. Spitefully cuts the PP of the foe's last move. Oh, okay, I didn't know what Spite did. Curse? I'd lose HP, so I don't like Curse. Dusko. Foresight. Astonish. Confuse Ray. And Pursuit. Evergrande City. Evergrande City has got to be where the Elite Four is. I'm gonna see if I can go to Sutopolis City. If not, then I will level up in Route 123. That is the plan. Guys, get cozy, get comfy. We are leveling.
Oh, my bag is full. Come on. Back to the Pokemon Center. I lied. We're gonna give Mariana the XP share, because I think Mariana is probably the best Pokemon for the dark types that I have. And I also think I'm gonna put my Nuzleaf in the box for now, and we'll level them up later. Because I don't think we'll need Nuzleaf for this gym. Because I want to bring back Zigzagoon, that way I can get more items, too. So, Nosleaf was a good choice to level up, but I should have leveled up Mighty Anna when I wanted to. But it's okay. So, let's see if I can get to Sutopolicity. I'm also going to change our pin chat. So I'm going to level as much as I can today. Route 127. Oh, Bellamer! You found one zinc. Double battle. We should have a slow and methodical match. Oh, I just realized if I have a double battle, I'm kind of cooked. Well, trainer Athena would like to battle. They sent out a Manectric. Oh no! Oh no. This is the worst outcome. Shit. Okay. 
I need to go back and swap one of my Pokemon for Ralph. Um... Okay, there... There, there was like no way he does like a shock and I die, right? There, there was like no way. <laughs> There's like no way, right? Why did I fill my whole party? I'm so stupid. There's no way. And I can't run either. Usually, whenever there's an lecture, they usually do the static first to paralyze me. Because the trainer's AI usually never does an offensive move first. Also, I have 150 XPs or HP, so I should be fine. Okay, I'm paralyzed, but that's okay. I don't have any ground types either. Holy fuck! Okay. See, the problem is now, that was a normal thunder. If that was a crit, I would guarantee die. I can't run away from this fight either. If I would have had Ralph, I'd be fine. I could keep healing Gyarados, but I genuinely don't want to lose him. I think my safest bet is to put in Shuppet. Because I don't think Electric, hopefully, <laughs> affects the ghost too much. And if I lose Shuppet, it'll be fine. Dude, what am I gonna do? 
Onyx would be immune to thunder? I don't have any- I- I can't leave this fight! Dude, why did I put all my Pokemon I want to level up in my party? That's so fucking stupid. I don't know- I don't know what to do! die here. Now this is the scenario in which it'd be good if a Pokemon had Protect. <laughs> question so right now the next pokemon will they get to do a turn or are they just gonna tank a hit first and then they can take a turn i need to know that before i move on because the next pokemon is obviously gonna die so i think i want to put a pokemon in and heal gyarados because gyarados can tank Because if so, I'll put in Snazzy. Because I have Linoon, Linoon can pick up items, it will be sad to kill Snazzy. You get a turn? Okay, good. Because, let's be honest, we're never going to use Snazzy in a battle and I have Linoon. Yeah, th that's what I have to do. Or, or, Absol has quick attack. Okay, okay. I am not losing Gyarados. I'm not losing Gyarados. I'm willing to sacrifice Absol and Snazzy. This is the plan. No, none of my Pokemon are holding the King's Rock. None of them are holding it. But Mikey does have Bite, which can flinch anyway. But High Shield, can we get some Yo's? Okay, the plan is simple. The plan is simple. I'm gonna put Absol in. Absol is going to quick attack. If Absol dies, oh well. Then we're going to put in Snazzy. Snazzy is going to get a turn, and then they're going to heal Magikarp. That's scenario one. Scenario two. Absol does quick attack. Absol lives. Absol then heals Magikarp. And then you go from there. Because I think... I think 
Quick attack guarantee goes first. Because Absol will get at least some HP down from the Manectric. The only thing I'm scared of is that this person has two Pokemon. Okay. Absol's going out. Also, I have to run an ad. I missed the ad. I'm sorry. I have to run an ad. Holy fuck. Holy fuck. Okay. okay, what do I do now? What do I do now? Holy shit. Okay, I'm paralyzed though. Dude, I'm like, my heart isn't beating, but I can feel like this sinking feeling in my chest. Absol has taunt. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, somebody tell me what taunt does. Doesn't taunt make them not use the last move they move they used? Okay, somebody tell me. I need to know. I need to know. Taunt either makes them not use the last move they moved, or make them not use the last move they used, or it takes away their PP. <laughs> I'm so scared. It means they can't use a non-attacking move. Wait, that's bad then. Shit. That's bad. I don't want offensive moves. <laughs> My hands are so cold. I'm getting chills. I think it's best if I try and get another attack in. Oh my god, you succeeded! Thank you, Absol! You're gonna die! No! <laughs> Dude, I can't lose like this! Dude, if I have to fucking reset... Okay, Snazzy goes in, Snazzy heals Magikarp, Magikarp goes in. Now that's- I think that's the only thing I can do. And they still have one more Pokemon. Dude, I'm gonna cry. I'm like... I'm pausing a lot because I don't, I don't want to do this. It's 
Snazzy's going in. far okay uh, can, okay can I just quit I want to quit can I quit Well... I've never seen this much red on the screen in a long time. So the problem is, my ghost Dust Dogs and Mighty Yona don't have the speed, so they're not even gonna get a hidden. I don't know what the other Pokemon is? Dude, I... I don't want to do this all again. The only thing I can do is put Magikarp in and just hope he doesn't fucking die. Yeah, that's the only thing I can do. And his attack was lowered? Holy fuck. Okay. Bite does more damage than Twister? He's dead. Okay, okay. I'm paralyzed, though. <gasps> yes! Thank you! Thank you! <laughs> cool trainer Athena's about to use Linoon. Oh my god, oh my god, will I change? No, holy shit. Thank you. Oh my god, I got so lucky! Dude, imagine she had another electric type? Holy shit. Okay. Sorry, I'm taking like 20 minutes on this fight, but... <laughs> okay. There's no way the Linoon kills me. Wait, he can serve? What the hell? <laughs> I forgot. I almost flipped off the camera, I was so angry. You know what, Hydro Pump, fuck you. You know what, I did swear. I'm gonna lose my mind. I am like thirsty for blood. You killed three of my team members due to my stupidity. You defeated Cool Trainer Athena. You didn't give me the chance to do any strategizing. No, yeah. yeah. My hands are shaking. Oh my god. Well, 
You know what? I guess that means we have less Pokemon to level up today. Fuck me. Oh my god. That could have been so bad. I was genuinely, like, so scared that I have to fucking reset everything. Oh my fucking god. I'm like... You guys can't tell. I'm on the verge of tears. I'm, like, so upset. Wait, I might actually... Wait. I need a minute. Oh, oh my god. I need a minute. <laughs> I'm stopping the timer. I need a minute. Oh my god. I'm, like, actually tearing up. I'm, like, so fucking mad at myself. Oh my god, I'm crying. I'm fine. Like, that was so fucking stupid. Why did I not have a high-level Pokemon with me? I- Why did I- oh, I've made this mistake before. Oh my god. Okay. Dude, that could have been, like- That would have been the- Biggest piece and fail. You know what? I need a break. I I need a I need a legit break. <laughs> Let's watch a YouTube video. Holy fuck! I'm saving my game, even though I don't want to fucking save. We're gonna watch a little YouTube video for like 10 minutes so I can like decompress, okay? Handshakes? I- 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 I need a few minutes. Oh my god. Okay, I'm gonna mute this. Okay, don't look at me, don't look at me, don't look at me, don't look at me. Let's find a short piece in video. Okay, yeah, this one's 10 minute long. We'll watch a 10 minute piece in video. YouTube time. Today I'm gonna be beating Demon. Stop, why are you playing? Okay. <laughs> We're gonna watch a little video. I'm gonna go wipe my eyes. The Hit Maroon 5 song. Okay. I need to calm down. So put your little emotes in chat. Pog. Saved. Level in my opinion in Super Mario Brothers Wonder, it is called Jump Jump Jump. It has made me rage quit before. The last time I played this on stream, I tried my for category to be I, I couldn't do it. My sister beat it for me offline the other day. Oopsie. So if we look at the game and it says I have all the coins, I have both seeds, it's not me. So I'm not I also don't want the Pokemon fans to cancel me for streaming in Pokemon, streaming but I'm not playing Pokemon. When I beat Wait, there's two jump, sub goals jump. on stream. Now I know some <laughs> few little tips and tricks. But no backseat gaming, I know what to do. Kind of. <laughs> Dude, I don't want to do this. I think I can beat this in... Realistically, two hours is my cap. But I think I can do an hour. I think I can do it. Do you think I can beat this challenge in one hour? <laughs> Realistically? Probably not, but I have faith and trust in Pixie Dust. Everybody get your stopwatches ready? I will beat Jump 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 stream ends when i beat jump 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 timer starts now wait i'm pressing the wrong button now <laughs> also i do have an attempt counter on screen it maxes at 100. pepe law wait, this level as you can see i have gone to see my sister did beat this level for me but i'm doing this to like get my pride back so I find the best strat is to actually jump when you hear the guitar twangs. Also, not to do hard jumps. Oh, 
more throwing. Also, please nobody clip the past 20 minutes. I will have a panic attack. <laughs> kidding? Not kidding. Dude. Okay. I I'm like, I'm calming down. I think legit that's the most upset I've got on stream. I'll be okay though. Let's, let's watch the little video. Okay. I know I messed up the time in there. I think the most grueling part about this level is that it takes like so long to reset. See, like each attempt takes one minute. It, it's so rude. And also you have to wait for three seconds at the start. Similar to when I did the darker side challenge, the anticipation just waiting annoys me so much. Okay, I find it best to jump here. Figuring out the distance in which you have to like jump, therefore do like a soft or hard press or press an O to B for that one takes forever to relearn. I tried to beat this level for like 20 minutes of the day and I couldn't do it, so I have about 40 minutes so far, like both on stream and offline. Oh my god! <laughs> Okay, no way you gotta save that. It's not going nearly fast enough. At least that was like the furthest I got today though. I got an hour. I can do this in an hour. Okay, yeah, watch this. Yeah, I'm not going- ah. Damn, that one was close though. I have like the timing down. I just need to go faster. I'm gonna practice with like normal boots first and I have the if I have the quicker boots unlocked and I will enable it. Go! Oh my god, dude! It's literally right there. It's literally right there. You know what's crazy? Okay, I can do this level like this almost time, perfectly every time. Usually now. I will keep my thumb on the directional stick, like in the center. But that time I kept it fully pushed <laughs> towards the right. And then I'm very pressured to go like faster or slower. Because I, I noticed anytime you go turn backwards to the left you lose that momentum so i'm trying to i'm gonna do this right just push to the right the whole time oh that was so good and yes i know there's a more difficult version of this level but i haven't unlocked it yet that'll be a separate stream i think it's best to stay ahead so jump whenever the block is about to appear that way you don't fall for too far behind i know what i have to do it's just a matter of executing it this is why I can't be a speedrunner. I would literally go insane. Oh, it's, it's over. It's over. <laughs> I think the trick is to not do hard presses for B or press and holds. Whenever you get too much air, I'm losing more momentum. See, right here, I can't afford to screw up. Why am I spin jumping so much? Okay, the only reason why I go for that side path is that I feel like it, you're supposed to stop your momentum there. Oh my god! Dude, if that I had a love. throne in that first section, I could have gone. I don't want to be here all day! losing my mind. How long has it been? It's been 20 minutes! It's over! Dude, I have it? It's not that I forget, I just don't know! Surely I won't be here all day. Smash cut to 5 hours in. I'm gonna be so happy when I beat this. Like, genuinely, I'm gonna cry happy tears. Moment of truth? Okay, 
Okay, I'm keeping up. No! Oh my god! Oh, I'm cooked. I'm cooked! I'm gonna do it this time. Wait, Colleen? Dude, actually I've never brutal. seen that stone ledge before. Oh my god. The trick in that final third section is to do quick B taps. No holding at all. And holding directional stick to the right. The whole, so hold directional stick to the right. And then soft B taps. Holy moly. Attempt number 26. That was a good one. My heart is racing. I'm gonna do this attempt. Mm hmm. Game ahead. When I fall, I like shake so much. I have no clue. I'm clueless. I'm just really angry. Oh, come on. Almost 30 minutes in. Oh my god. Oh, dude, I could have saved it. Attempt number 31. Get my head. No way. Ain't no way. I did it. <laughs> okay, under 30 minutes? That's not bad. I genuinely thought this would take like, okay, not all day, but like two hours. Dude, I'm a gamer. I'm a gamer. I gotta go tell my sister. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna text her. Let's see what she says. I beat the level. No fast shoes. Just wall jump edge in less than 30 minutes. Let's see what she says. <laughs> okay, she responded, okay, do love. Dude, I haven't unlocked that yet. Editor, put the screenshot of when I beat the game here. Put it here. I beat <laughs> jump, jump, jump. <laughs> I forgot I motion tracked that. I don't want to watch that yet. Less than 30 minutes. Let's see what she says. <laughs> okay, she responded, okay, do love. Dude, I haven't unlocked that yet. Editor, put the screenshot of when I beat the <laughs> game so here. Put it here. I beat jump, jump. <laughs> Okay, okay. Oh, where's my camera? I feel better now. Holy shit. Dude. I feel better now. I didn't even cry cry. Oh my god. Okay. Back to peace lock. Time to release those suckers. Thank you guys for waiting. I, I genuinely needed time to, like, calm down. Like, <laughs> I, al I almost made some Minecraft jokes, if you catch my drift. Like, if, if I would have lost the run there, that would have been my 13th reason, okay? Like, holy fuck. Oh my god. I still cannot believe that. Okay. I genuinely got so lucky. So lucky.
I genuinely got so lucky that one of the Thunderbolts missed on Absol. That way Absol got one more hit in. Because if that hit hadn't gone in, then Magar would have had to hit twice with Bite. And he probably wouldn't have survived that. And honestly, so, so lucky that their second Pokemon was Linode. But otherwise, that was not good. That was horrible. Now, I need to absolutely make sure... When I, whenever I'm leveling, I still have a powerful team. Because I, I think the reason why I put all the dark and I put all the dark and ghost Pokemon in the party is because I thought I was just going to go straight back to Luliko. But I didn't. I was like, okay, I'm going to go in the water and explore. But I forgot that there's going to be encounters. So that was my L. So I'm going to go back in, have at least four strong Pokemon in the party, go do the battles. And then go back to like normal leveling up and grinding. That's the plan. But first, we have to go kill the Pokemon. Okay. Genuinely, thank you guys for waiting. I, I needed that 10 minutes. And it was like 9 o'clock in a little YouTube video, okay? Call me, call me the evil maniac, but I think some of the videos are fun. Oh my god, it is loud. Holy shit, thank you, Ryan. I'm sorry. <laughs> I forget. It was up for the YouTube video. Thank you for telling me. <laughs> thank you. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Sorry, headphone users. I'm sorry. Um, anyway. What was I saying? Trigger warning. I've only had, like, maybe three panic attacks in my life. I've had a lot of anxiety attacks. So, an anxiety attack is, like, very similar to a panic attack, but a panic attack has more like physical symptoms. Like a panic attack feels like a heart attack, basically. But a anxiety attack is more like, it's more in your head, like you still get some of the physical symptoms, but it's not as bad as a panic attack. Okay, we're back at the Pokemon Center. Let's heal our fallen soldiers. So it was Snazzy, Absol, and Shuppet, who died. Man. So I guess Gyarados is worth three Pokemon lives. Well. Absol, we didn't know you for long. But you made a valiant sacrifice. You fought well. Everybody, peace, I-27, Absol. Goodbye, Abby. Shuppet, you're allegedly a useless Pokemon, but I think you're cute. But once again, thank you for your valiant sacrifice. You will get a purple heart. Bye, Shut It. And finally, Snazzy. Snazzy has been with us for this whole run, picking up items, grinding. Snazzy's been on that Sigma grind set, but you know what? This is what Snazzy would have wanted. They wanted. They would have wanted to make a sacrifice for the team. So everybody, was Snazzy my first Pokemon this run? Wait, I gotta check. I think Snazzy was my first Pokemon. No, it wasn't. Snazzy was my... Snazzy was my fourth Pokemon. You're not special anymore. Everybody, peace I-27, Snazzy. Goodbye, Snazzy. That was an absolutely fucking de detrimental battle. A level 30 Manectric took out three soldiers due to my stupidity. It will not happen again. Do not worry. We're bringing in Erend and Ralph. That way for encounters, I have Dark Water 
and Dragon, Psychic, Steel, Normal. I'll bring Blaziken. No. I'll bring Blaziken. So I'm only gonna level up one Pokemon at a time. Made that mistake before. Let's see, I got Graveler, Blaziken, Aaron, Gardevoir, Mightyena. Okay, I think this is a fairly versatile team. We don't have time to mourn the dead, we must continue on. Back to the water. Bird Pokemon have excellent vision. They spot prey from great heights. Okay, flying Pokemon. Man, if I would have fought him first, I would have been fine. Bird Keeper Aiden would like to battle. They sent out a Swellow. Level 32. You know what? Why not, Surf? Why not? Okay, now, now I feel good. We're fine now. Oh my goodness. I'm like, I'm gonna have PTSD. I'm not even kidding. <laughs> Mikey grew to level 26. Bird Keeper Aiden is about to use Skarmory. Will I change? No. Bite has no effect against him, I think. Oh, what? What? Okay, Dragon is not effective against Skarmory. Skarmory is steel flying. Is Dragon strong against steel? What? You defeated Bird Keeper Aiden. Huh, I, I thought, I thought he said I, I grew up. I give up. You got two thousand and forty Poké Dollars for winning. Steel does resist Dragon. That makes no sense. But now I know. You found one rare candy. Okay, I guess the candy's worth it. Oh my goodness. Okay. Sorry. I'm, I'm gonna finish what I was saying earlier. I legit almost had a panic attack earlier. And like, you know, I was doing my deep breathings. And I have learned for me, if there's any point in which I get really anxious, I just need to like, leave the situation. Like if it's somebody I'm talking to, I'm like, hey, I'll call you back. Or if it's like a situation in public, I'm like, okay, I'm gonna leave. But man, that could've been very bad. Dude, legit, I, I'm gonna keep yapping about it for a little bit. 
If I would have lost the run there, shit. You guys would never let me live that down. <laughs> Sutopolis has got to be this way. Oh, wait, no. Surely? Route 126. Kate is to the left. Do trainer battles, but I have to. This towering white mountain of rock is Pseudopolis City. Swimmer Dean would like to battle. They sent out a Carvana level 31. They have three Pokemon in total. Dean is about to use Carvana. Will I change? No. Why do you have more than one Carvana? Ooh, I'm scared. Is about to use Wingo. Will I change? No. Level 31 Wingo? The flying moves do kind of hurt me, so I'm going to heal first. Just to be safe, I am not losing Magikarp. Ain't no way. That did three damage. You defeated Swimmer Dean. I was done in. You got 496 Poké Dollars for winning. this ocean area. It reminds me too much of an open world game and I hate open world games. I like when games hold my hand a little bit. And by a little bit, I mean a lot. The whole time. My love language is touch. Don't poison me! And Serio... Die. I 
I wonder if I have any repels. I put them all away. It's fine. Encounters are fine. Wow. <laughs> Dodged. I'm throwing my whole heart into this. Swimmer? Sierra would like to battle. They sent out a love disc. Okay, don't kiss me. Por favor. No quiero un... Un? Una? Beso. I know beso is kiss. Easy. Mikey grew to level 27. Mikey's trying to learn swagger. Now, swagger is really annoying to deal with, but it's kind of like a SLA to use. Confuses the foe, but also raises their attack. Oh, wait. Maybe it's not a SLA. <laughs> I forgot it does that too. I'll be honest, I don't like any of my Diana's status moves. I don't want to learn Swagger. I think it's too risky. Because, like, if they're confused but then they also hit me, like, I die. Oh, I don't want to change Pokemon, I lied. Magikarp is my goat. It's actually a huge L that I lost Absol. But I got Mighty Anna, so I should be okay. And I got Magikarp. You defeated Swimmer Sienna. You had more heart. You got 528 Poké Dollars for winning. Oh wait, I'm still in just chatting. I forgot, I forgot. I'll fix that. May all be day. I don't want to get in trouble. Check out the sculpted body. I'm more cut than a black belt. What does that mean, sir? Triathlete Pablo would like to battle. They sent out a star you, level 33. <laughs> Minimize? He's dying! <laughs> I've never seen that animation before.
Triathlete Pablo is about to use Star. You will I change? No. Another one? Oh, I wanted to see the minimize animation again. You defeated Triathlete Pablo. Whoops, too strong. Not bad. Not bad at all. You got 2,640 Pokedollies for winning. Yep, you're not bad at all. I like to get to know you more. Ew, I think he's a playground man. Swimming is a full body workout. You will get fit. Swimmerberry would like to battle. They sent out a Gyarados. What was that? Okay, I don't like that. became confused due to fatigue. Guess I'm glad I didn't learn Guess I'm glad I didn't learn Dredge. Sir for fun. Drown. Maggie grew to level 44. Let's go. Mikey grew to level 28. Let's go. You defeated Swimmer Barry. I admit it, you win. You got 544 Pokedollies for winning. Peason, how do you do? This is Isabel. Just now I tried to catch a cute Electrag. It got away though. Oh, you bet I was disappointed. Bye bye. Yeah, sure you are, kid. 
Swimmer Nikki would like to battle. Do something to Meryl, level 33. Uh-oh. Swimmer Nikki is about to use Seal. Will I change? No. Seal is poison water type, I believe. Oh, wait, no. It's ice? Um. Oh, but. I do know that ice is strong against dragon. I do know that. Ralph is in. I'm, I'm not. I'm not fucking around no more. Oh, wait, Gyarados is not a dragon type. Wait, is he? I gotta double check later. You defeated Swimmer Nikki. My fantasy burst as if it were a bubble. Blub, blub, blub. We got 520 Poké Dollars for winning. Oh, well, Gyarados is water flying. Okay. So I, I would have been fine against the seal. I was. I just got nervous. It's Daba Nerviosa. You know who else is going to be shaking in their boots? The non-subs. Because guys, we are three hours into stream, so it's time for me to run some ads. You can avoid the ad by subscribing for $4.99, just $5. Skip your coffee and get ad previewing all month long. Or you can link your Amazon Prime to your Twitch and hashtag sub for free with Prime. Click subscribe, see if you got a sub available, and if you subscribe, you can kill my Pokemon. But please don't. I've already, I've already lost three Pokemon today. So don't. Wait, I need to update the counter as well. Shit, man, I lost three Pokemon today. Better safe than sorry, dude. That's usually how I play. Pokemon released, I'm at 11. Holy shit. Double digits, guys. <laughs> Look, it, the number's too big. It doesn't even fit on the screen. How pitiful. Man, 11 Pokemon. Shit. Okay, I have to cross them off my list before I forget. So we lost Snazzy Zigzagoon. And then I lost Shuppet. And Absol. Okay, the list has been updated. Man, it's okay. I'm not I'm not mad anymore. I acknowledge my mistakes. Sometimes your L's can become W's. Like how do I get in here? Oh, is it like an underground city? Yo. I probably gotta defeat Team Agua and take their submarine. Oh, yeah! One of the scientists said there's a cave in 128.
Well, hey, this is a match between a Pokemon fan and a fishing buff. Fishman and Roger would like to battle. They sent out a magic card. Level 15. Dude, you're almost like at the Elite Four City. What are you doing with a level 15 magic card? Fisherman Roger is about to use Magikarp. Will I change? No. Wait, maybe I should put out Ralph that way I save Magikarps. Oh, a level 25. Oof. Fisherman Roger is about to use a Gyarados. Will I change? No. Level 35. Okay, I'm good. I'm good. This Gyarados is strong. My defense fell. Uh-oh. Okay, stop lowering my defense, that's not chill. That did nothing. Okay. Oh, wait! Oh, wait, I had Dragon Rage before. It does 40. Okay, that's, that's not horrible. I'm faster. You defeated Fisherman Roger. No, my line's all tangled. The party's over. You got two thousand two. You got two thousand eight hundred Poké dollars for winning. You kind of cooked me a little bit. I think I'm gonna try and do all the encounters on these routes and then go back to heal. Another fisherman? Wow. Whoops, don't tell me I snagged a surfing Pokemon. <laughs> fisherman Henry would like to battle. They sent out a Carvana level 31. Watch this. Fisherman Henry is about to use a tentacle. Will I change? Yes. Poison type is weak against psychic. Easy. Mikey grew to level 29. Get in there. You defeated Fisherman Henry. I can't keep up. 
You got 2,720 Poké Dollars for winning. Through fishing, I have attained a state of Becalm Serenity. Please allow me to demonstrate. If you're talking about peace, you better be doing protect every round. Fisherman Jonah would like to battle. They sent out a Whalemer, level 30. They have three Pokemon in total. I only got one bot left. Serio? Fisherman Jonah is about to use a tentacle. Will I change? Yes. To round. Our goat. Fisherman Jonah is about to use Sharpedo. Will I change? Yes. Sharpedo is the evolved for a Carvana. So Magikarp is probably the best. Gotta go, no problem. Thanks for hanging out, Kimari. Buenas noches. We'll see you next time. How is he faster than me? Oh, the scary face lowers my speed. I thought it lowered my defense. Um, Kalunas. But I still won in the end. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. You defeated Fisherman Jonah. Though I have lost, my heart remains calm. You got 2,560 Poké Dollars for winning. We're gonna give some leper bears to Maggie Car. Dang, a level six tentacle? Thought it was gonna be a secret.
and keep exploring. Did I fight you already? No. Okay. <laughs> I can see it in your face. You want to challenge me. Not really, but you know I gotta. Triathlete Camden. Triathlete Camden would like to battle. They set up to star you, level 33. <laughs> I think that's my favorite animation in the game. Triathlete Camden is about to use Star You. Will I change? No. Mikey grew to level 30. Let's go. Eat a bit of triathlete, Camden. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> you got 2,640 Poké Dollars for winning. Mario sounding ass. Now this guy is gonna have fighting types, they're gonna move in round. Running your bare feet, that'll toughen up your souls. Black Pet Koji would like to battle. They sent it a macho, level 34. <laughs> Little does he know, I have a psychic type. Watch this. Hell yeah! You defeated Black Belt Koji. Ouch! I got a pebble under my toenail. Ooh, that sounds horrible. You got one thousand and eighty-eight Poké Dollars for winning. This is what I do to people who beat me. I hope I can do this again. Hello, this is Walter. You sound well, Peason. I've traveled around the world, and I must say I've taken a great shine to this region. I plan to stay here a while. Perhaps we can meet again. I've not forgotten your dazzling techniques. I do hope for a rematch. Why has everybody risen me up? They don't, they don't need to do that. Oh, there's a town here. I want to keep exploring, but like, I don't want to risk like my Pokemon dying. Oh, 
wait, Snazzy was my Pokemon that I taught all the HMs to. Damn. So if I go back, I'm gonna have to teach them all to Linoon. Route 128, this is where the secret canal is. We've been working so hard to mount a Pokemon League challenge. We can afford to lose now. Cool trainer Alexa would like to battle. They sent out a Gloom, level 34. At least the Pokemon in this area and trainers aren't like crazy strong. I was expecting like level 50 encounters at this point. That's not ideal. Cool trainer Alexa is about to use Azumarill. Will I change? Azumarill has water and roll out, which is a rock type. They're not strong against Ralph, but Ralph is paralyzed, so I should change. Sag Mary. Oh, the Surf did more damage than the other moves. Serio? You defeated Cool Trainer Alexa. Oh, how could this happen? You got 3,264 Poké Dollars for winning. We continue on. Ooh. 
Oh, he caught me! <laughs> Evergrande City is still a long ways away. Is it really? Triathlete Isaiah would like to battle. They sent to the Staryu level 35. You defeated Triathlete Isaiah. My first victory seems to be far away, too. You got 2,800 Pokemon dollars for winning. I know I'm not good now, but I think I can win eventually. Please register me in your Pokemon app. Oh, this is just a circle. You can probably fish there, that's why. Route 129. Yeah, I need to go to the right. Ooh! <laughs> I'm gonna dodge that for now. Oh, can I not go to the right? But sure, why don't we battle? Triathlete Allison would like to battle. They sent out a Wingo, level 27. <laughs> Imagine. Triathlete Allison is about to use Staryu. Will I change? No. A level Mikey grew to level 31. You defeated Triathlete Allison. I was sure I'd win. You got 2,640 Poké Dollars for winning. Oh, peace and hello. This is Jessica. Listen, I came within a whisker of catching this wingle, but it gave me the slit. I need to try harder. See you around. How big is this area? Oh no, I'm not going that way. I need to go to the right and then up. Yeah, there's so many different trainer battles I'm gonna have to do. 
I think I'm gonna backtrack up. Just so I can fully restore Magikarp's PP. After these two fights, I think. Because I'm, I'm convinced the next city is right here. What's the hurry? Let's take it slow and easy. Wait, I just realized, what if I run into Brendan? Sumer Tisha sent out Chincho. Which is electric water, so I'm gonna swap out right away. Easy. You defeated Swimmer Tisha. Oh my, I wanted to relax a little more. You got $544 for winning. Surfing isn't as easy as it seems, isn't that right? Swimmer Clarence would like to battle. They sent out a Sharpedo, level 34. That did a good handful of damage. But not enough to scare me. But this scary face will scare me for sure. You defeated Swimmer Clarence. Winning sure isn't easy. You got 544 Pokedollars for winning. Oops, he caught me. This is my first triathlon. I'm all tense and nervous. Dragly Chase would like to battle. They sent it a Wingle, level 26. Magikarp grew to level 45. Magikarp is turned on Rain Dance. Let's see. Rain Dance. Boost the power of water time moves for 5 turns. That's stupid. I don't want that. Full offensive. Magikarp did not learn rain dance. I don't care. Triathlete Chase is about to use 3. Will I change? Yeah. I'm gonna put in Ralph. Triathlete Chase. I failed to win. You got 2,720 Poké Dollars for winning.
Wait, what? We're at 128. Oh, it's 128 and then to the right. I went too far left. I'm gonna go behind this guy. I just wanna to get to the city so I can heal, and then I'll make my way back. I just really hope Brandon's not here. seems to be more harsh in this area. Swimmer Carly would like to battle. They sent out a Sea King. Now that's poison swimming. You defeated Swimmer Carly. I couldn't see very well because of the sun's glare. You got 560 Poké Dollars for winning. Oh, I should have tried to intercept it further up. A level 5 tentacle. dodged. Level 8 tentacle. I'm only doing hundred bunks because I don't want to waste a turn. I, I, I just want to get to the city. City. Brandon better not be here. Oh, wait. Wait, can I not? Can I not go in the city?
That's so unfair. And none of my Pokemon can fly. This- this can't be real. That's probably like a HM I learned after a gym. Oh, that's so annoying. What now? Okay, I can backtrack and go to Moss Deep. Or... I can just go to Pacific Log. It's probably safer if I just go back to Lost Deep. Oh, man. What does teleport do? Wait, what? Wanna return to the healing spot you used last in Lost Deep City? Yeah? Wait, what? <laughs> what? That's crazy! I was wondering why teleport was an actionable move in the menu. Wait, that's wild! That's so cool! Man, Ralph is the best. So I guess I don't necessarily need to teach Pokemon Fly for now. Oh, that's so cool! Ralph is my goat. Okay, I think I'm gonna keep going down the water rocks and do all the trainer battles. I know I missed a few. And I'll keep Ralph as the party leader, that way I level up Ralph too in the background. Because we're not going to need Ralph to the next gym, so we can level up Ralph like crazy. Try to find this Route Mikey grew to level 32. Mikey's trying to learn Scary Face. Scary Face frightens us with frightens with a scary face to sharply reduce the opponent's speed. I think Roar is dumb, so I'll swap it out for Roar. Why not? Mikey learned Scary Face. Yeah, I was here before already. Okay, I gotta get to 128 right here. So there should be a secret cave here somewhere.
I think I fought this guy already. Yeah, I did. Okay. One twenty nine. I went too far south. Yeah, I've been here before. Ralph grew to level 42. Ralph is trying to learn Future Sight. Future Sight heightens inner power to strike two turns later. Now, this one I think is stupid. It has less accuracy than Psychic and Confusion. And it only has 80 power, so I think it's dumb. I tried it with Kadabra, it was dumb. I'm not going to learn Future Sight. Okay, I'm in 128. So the cave has got to be somewhere here. Because I avoided this area because I wanted to go to the city. There was no stronger trainer than I. Trainer Ruben would like to battle. They sent out a shift tree. Shift tree is grass and dark. We're switching. Blaziken. Finally, Blaziken gets some action. His first fight of the day. Or real fight, rather. You try your best to raise your defense. You're not going to live past this. Watch this. Wait, what? No! <laughs> okay, watch this. Take the L. Cool Trainer Ruben is about to use Nose Pass. Will I change? Oh, Nose Pass is ground psychic, I believe. So I'm going to change to make it car. Or wait, or he's rock. It makes he's literally a stone. He's probably rock. You defeated Cool Trainer Ruben. This can't be. You got 3,264 Pokedollars for winning. 
I think Magikarp still has the amulet. Yeah, they do. I'm gonna take the amulet and give it to Ralph. Yeah, nothing here. I know there was a fisherman down here. Oh, here he is. Visit Ever Grand, so I call myself a Pokemon that knows the move Waterfall to press the falls. Oh, so it is another HM. Damn. Fisherman Wayne would like to battle. He sent it a tentacle, level 31. <laughs> Watch this. Fisherman Wayne is about to use Veilmer. Will I change? No. Because none of Veilmer's or my attacks are strong or weak against each other. So I'm just going to do a Psychic. Because I am faster. Oh, never mind. Still strong enough. Mikey grew to level 33. Let's go. Fisherman Wayne is about to use Tentacle. Will I change? No. The Ralph Sweep! You defeated Fisherman Wayne. I'm Chris Fallen. You got 2,880 Poké Dollars for winning. You got me! You have to swim, cycle, and then run a marathon in a triathlon. It's a grueling race that consists of three events. Triathlete Caitlin would like to battle. They sent it a star you, level 35. Confusion should be able to one hit KO this.
You defeated Triathlete Caitlyn. A Pokemon battle is grueling, too. You got 2,800 Poké Dollars for winning. Well, I may as well make the best of this. I'd like a rematch sometime. There's nothing there. I dodged him last time. <laughs> You're looking awfully tough. I wonder if I can win. Swimmer Harrison would like to battle. They sent out a tentacle, level 35. Oh, that didn't KO. You defeated Swimmer Harrison. Ouch, I guess it was impossible to win. You got 560 Poké Dollars for winning. Yeah, I've been here before. Yeah, back to Evergrande. I can't find the tunnel. Yeah, 128 is just this horizontal strip, and I think I've explored every part of it. Hmm. I think what I'll do is I'll make my way to Pacific Log Town. And I'll double check 128 again for the cave. be in here.
I'm gonna see if I can get around this. There's nothing here. Hmm. Hey, Ralph is out of confusion, so I gotta go back and heal. else I gotta do run an ad because guys we are four hours in the stream so it's time for me to run some more ads so get over that ad by subscribing for $4.99 just five dollars skip your coffee and get ad free viewing all month long or you can link your Amazon Prime to Twitch and hashtag sub for free with Prime click subscribe see if you got a sub available and if you subscribe you can kill my Pokemon do it but also don't I've already lost three soldiers today I, I don't I don't want to lose anymore so get some water, get a snack. I'll see some of you guys in a few. Also, I gotta use the restroom, so I will be right back. Put your favorite emote in chat. I wanna see it. Yo, I'm back. Your timer's restart. I'm back in. Oh yeah, I fought that guy already. I'm I'm clueless. I don't know where the secret cave is. I'll look it up later though. Cause I gotta go here, Ralph. Scientist wrong? It's it's 
gotta be in this little patch with the deep water. It's gotta be. Okay, well, I'm gonna go teleport back and heal. Actually, the teleport transportation is huge. Continue on. Mikey grew to level 34. Get in there. Oh, I didn't find you yet. <laughs> Do you have a rival whom you just hate to lose against? Yeah, Brendan. But I've never lost against him, besides the one time where I had to reset, because I just got a Torchic, and then I died. Charlie Donnie sent out a Wingle, level 26. I've only lost to Brandon once. And it was pitiful. But I, I cannot afford to lose a Brandon at this point in the run. I cannot afford it. Try think Donnie's about to use a star. You will I change? No. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. You defeated Triathlete Donnie. Aw, oh, I hate losing. You got 2,720 Poker Dollars for winning. Okay, 128 is here. And then I fall in. No. Wait, have I caught a Tentacruel? I don't think I've run into a Tentacruel. I've run into playing Tentacruel, but not Tentacruel. I'm gonna sneak in here. 126. Yeah, this ain't it. I've been here already. I think that scientist was gaslighting me.
Okay, I'm right in the middle of the far left 128 route. If I don't find the cave, I'm just gonna progress to the next city. Ralph grew to level 43. Let's go. One twenty nine. Okay, so it's back up here. Only five more hours to 100? I know, right, man? Get ready to spam. You were here. Imagine being a level 7 tentacle. Wait, I just realized the Moss Deep Gym is a double team gym. Because I got two leaders. That means it really fucking sucks that I lost one of every Dark and Ghost Pokemon. Okay, my only theory now is to try and fish here. Because maybe if I pull up a fish, maybe I'll pull up a sum submarine. Because I do have the super rod. Not even a nibble. Damn it. Really? I'll try right here then. No, I, I don't want to surf. <laughs> Wait, can I surf and use the rod? I can! It got away? Shoot. I spam clicked A by accident. It got- wait, what? Am I supposed to spam? Okay, I'm just gonna press A once. Not even a nibble. Oh, we gotta wait for the timing. Okay. A Pokemon's on the hook. Let's see. A Whalmer? I don't have a Whalmer yet. <laughs> the Whalmer's oblivious. <laughs> me too, me too. I gotta catch three more Pokemon to make it for my losses today. So I break even, so the boss don't get mad. 
Nice. Any flinch? Time for a book ball. Yeah, dive ball. A ball that works better on Pokemon on the ocean floor. This one. Give me the wing bar, please. I need a dub. Trying a nest ball. Better stay in there, Wilmer. <laughs> Wilmer, ball whale Pokemon. While this Pokemon usually lives in the sea, it can survive on land, although not too long. It loses vitality if its body becomes dried out. Our first new Pokemon of the day. The sprite looks wild. Just the two single dots for the eyes? That looks wild. Our first catch of the day. Holy moly. I'm gonna name him Wilbur. <laughs> I almost called it Wilbur by accident too, so I think it's fitting. Everybody, welcome Wilbur to the team. Finally, a Pokemon. Well, my theory was incorrect. There is not a secret in that deep hole. The scientist said there was a secret cave on 128. And I've explored literally all of 128. Maybe it's like in the waterfall or some shit? Okay. The plan is simple. I'm gonna just go to the far left to Pisid... I'm gonna go to the far left to Pacific to Pacific Log Town, and then just loop around. A girl named Wilbur. Mary was a boy too. <laughs> I don't care. Oh hi! I'm still searching for treasures with Kyra. Maybe there isn't any treasure here at all. But the important thing is for me to search alongside Kyra. Oh hey Kyra, why are you so angry? I'm not ignoring you, honey. You're my one and only. Peason, I have to go. Bye. I think the Pokemon genders only really matter in the game if you're trying to breed and get eggs, but I'm not trying to, like, have my Pokemon smash. I want them to, like, smash in the destructive way, not the fun way. I think there's only two gyms left. I fought this person already. Am I nervous? Not anymore. I think that one encounter a few hours ago, like, rattled me. Nothing else can scare me at this point. Because if I can survive that, which granted, it was purely luck. I can survive anything. I didn't mean to click send on that. Okay. <laughs> Wait, do I seem nervous? Am I nervous for the Elite Four? No. I I'm obviously not gonna do the Elite Four challenge until all my Pokemon are leveled. And for the Elite Four, they have Pokemon 46 to 58. So I need to get my Pokemon to 60. There's no going back on it. I don't fucking care if it takes me forever. All my Pokemon are gonna be level 60. So, and the plan is simple. For the Elite Four, you need a versatile team. You can't just go in with all water types because that's fucking stupid. So, I feel confident. A Waylord? I didn't know they showed up on the surface. 
Yo! Okay. Okay. He's probably not going to want to stay in the Pokeball, though. Hopefully, Wailor does not have self-destruct. Surely he does not. Uh-oh. Okay, that only did 10 damage, so that's not horrible. I'm not scared. Ooh, he flinched! Oh, Netball. Of all the works, will and water and bug type. I'll try it. I'll try it. Blink! <laughs> okay. Um. Oh, he's using rollout. Uh oh. If I bite, he's going to die. Surf is still too powerful. Cause surf is like a hundred attack, I think, or hundred power. You know what? Why not? I'm gonna use Ultra Ball. Screw you! I can always buy more. Yo! Waylord was cut! Waylord, Float Whale Pokemon. It breathes through nostrils that it raises above the sea. By inhaling to its maximum capacity, a Waylord can dive close to 10,000 feet beneath the waves. Oh, his sprite looks cute. Okay. We're gonna name it after Lord the Singer. But I think their name has an E, right? Yeah, it is with an E. That's what I thought. Okay. Everybody, welcome Lord to the team. Yes, Lord is in Pokemon. Yo. I thought Whale Lord was like a diving Pokemon, but I just caught him randomly. That's pretty cool. I think I fought these two already. Yeah, I did. Okay. Okay, I gotta go to the far land. Okay. Route 130. Ooh! <laughs> he caught me! What a surprise! I didn't expect to see a trainer out in the sea. I think we should battle. Swimmer Rodney would like to battle the Ascent of Gyarados, level 34. I'm gonna switch. Oh, I didn't heal Gyarados. Cause G if Gyarados bites me, Ralph is in trouble. Okay, he keeps lowering my defense. I'm gonna heal just to be safe. I'm not playing around. Cut back to where I lost three Pokemon in one fight.
Hit yourself. <laughs> Take the L. You defeated swimmer Rodney. This kid's awfully tough. You got 544 Pokedollings for winning. I only got two super potions left. Uh oh. I forgot to go to the super mall. Meal every day. Battle is W. Mikey grew to level 35. And we've been leveling for 4 hours, and Mikey's only up 10 levels. It's kinda wild. They just don't stop, do they? I think the only area where I would genuinely consider using a repel is the ocean area. Or wherever there's a lot of Poochianas, because they're also really annoying. Secret, come on. Oh, you got me in the deep blue sea. My shattered blue heart finds comfort among waves. Ooh, so edgy. Swimmer Katie would like to battle. They sent out a gold dean, level 33. They have two Pokemon in total.
Swimmer Katie is about to use seal. Will I change? No. <laughs> it's so cute. Easy. You defeated Swimmer Katie. Like the vast blue sea, the world of Pokemon spans depths beyond belief. You got 528 Poké Dollars for winning. Dead end. Still on Route 130. Oh! Hello, sir. Floating on the open sea like this, it's peaceful. Swimmer Santiago would like to battle. They sent out a tentacruel, level 33. <laughs> Watch this. Easy. Swimmer Santiago is about to use a whim, or will I change? No. You defeated Swimmer Santiago. I needed to be a little less peaceful. You got 520 Poké Dollars for winning. You know who else can be hashtag winning the followers? Because guys, we are another 30 minutes in the stream. So if you're new here, click that follow button. You get clipped and you get to type a chat. Isn't that pretty cool? Turn that heart button purple. And if you're already following, make sure notifications are turned on. That way you don't miss a single stream. I continue on. Oh, that was supposed to be a double battle. Dodged. Another de double battle, 131. The people of Pacific Log are a peaceful bunch. They never get angry. That goes for me, too. Wait, are they a bunch of hippies? They better not be doing drugs. Swimmer Kevin would like to battle. They sent out a Sphiel, level 34. You defeated Swimmer Kevin. Oops. You got 544 Poké Dollars for winning. I only got three more encounters for Ralph. In serio? Mikey grew to level 36. Finally at 100 HP. Oh, we have another swimmer right there. I'm gonna go ahead and give Ralph a Lepaberry. I got I got 40. If you can beat me, I can give you some great information. She's a fed! 
Any feds in chat? Type 1. Triathlete Talia would like to battle. The Ascent of the Star You, level 34. Easy. You defeated Triathlete Talia. Oh, did I lose? You got 2,720 Poké Dollars for winning. Dead end. Oh, this guy goes in an L. Let's cut him off. The sea is teeming with Pokemon. It's not easy swimming, I'll tell you. Swimmer Richard would like to battle. They sent the developer, level 34. Oh, why'd I switch Pokemon? Really? You're such a whim. You're only protecting because you're scared of me, aren't you? What is that? What is that? <laughs> Was that a move like Bide Stockpile? Uh oh. You defeated Swimmer Richard. Pokemon raised by trainers are seriously tough. You got 544 Pokemon dollars for winning. I continue on. Another swimmer? You caught me! Why do men love bathing suits so much? They all ogle me. This is a kid's game! Swimmer Kara sent out a Sea King, level 34. Um, all I gotta say to you, Kara, is join the 4B movement. Look it up. You defeated Swimmer Kara. I'm out of my doubt. We got 544 Poké Dollars for winning. Oh, he's just looking. The sea, the sea, the sea. The sea's far as these eyes can see. I'm sick and tired of the sea. <laughs> Swimmer Herman would like to battle. They sent out a wingle, level 33. Ralph is really close to leveling up. Ooh, you got me. Ralph grew to level 44. Let's go! Swimmer Herman is about to use Tentacruel. Will I change? No. A level 33 Tentacruel. You defeated Swimmer Herman. But You got 528 Poké Dollars for winning. <laughs> Why'd he just yak on me? That's TOS. Oh my god, there's so many trainers here. Hi, Dio Mio. I think I'm gonna give Ralph one more a Lepa Berry. Yeah, I got Magikarp as my second party member. Let's do this double battle. Let's get it over with. We'll work together as siblings to take you on. Sea 
Sis and Bro Riley and Ian would like to battle. They sent out a Zumuro and Wingle. Magikarp is so cool. The Twister did nothing on Azumarill. Oh wait, sorry, I'm Wingle. I was looking at the wrong one. Wait, no. I don't remember. <laughs> Sis and bro Riley and Ian. We couldn't win even though we worked together. We got 1,584 Poké Dollars for winning. It's like taking candy from a baby. And I see the town right there. Wingo level 25. I guess this is the last fight. After this encounter. Sweetie, wait, we should battle you. Wait, hi, sweetie, wait, we should battle you and I. Swimmer Susie would like to battle. They sent out a love disc, level 34. Mikey grew to level 37, almost ready for the gym. Mikey's trying to learn takedown. Takedown normal, a reckless charge attack that also hurts the user. No, I don't want that. I don't want anything that hurts myself. Yes, I want to forget it. You defeated Swimmer Susie. You're tough in spite of the way you look. You got 544 Poké Dollars for winning. Finally, the city! Pacific Log Town. Oh, because we're walking on logs! <laughs> Finally, civilization! Mirage Island! It must become visible and invisible depending on the weather conditions that make mirages appear. Or is it really appearing and disappearing? I can't see Mirage Island today. Wait, do you think they're gay? Or just roommates? Okay, I'll get out. The sea between Pacific Log and Slateport has a fast running tide. If you decide to surf, you could end up swept away somewhere else. Is that a Pokedex? Did you get to meet a lot of different Pokemon? I wish I was like you. I'll just do it, Shia LaBeouf. Leave your hubby. Check out this horsey. It's the horsey that I caught yesterday to celebrate my birthday. Oh, I can see that you want it. After all, it's priceless. I'll tell you what. 
I might be willing to trade it for a bag and- No! Oh, so you're not gonna- So you're not gonna go through with this. That's cool. I'm not desperate to make a trade or anything. A baggin? That's the one that turns into salamence. Wait! No. Yeah, that's the one that turns into salamence. I ain't doing that shit. You don't. Does he have a Zoomer for trade? <laughs> I am the Pokemon fan club's most important person, the chairman's younger brother. I'm here enjoying my vacation with Pokemon, yes indeed. Ha! Huh. Your Pokemon, it clearly likes you very much. A Pokemon that adoring and adorable deserves a TM like this, no? You obtained the TM27. If a Pokemon likes you a lot, returns power is enhanced. If it doesn't like you, frustration's power go up. Huh? Number 27, return. The more the user likes you, the more powerful this move. Now that sounds dumb. Ahoy, Elliot here. As always, I'm fishing with wild abandon. Are there other places I can fish than the sea and the rivers? I get these powerful lurges to fish just about anywhere. Oh, gosh darn it, my line's tangled up. Gotta go. Find me some new fishing spots. See? Isn't it neat? These houses are in water. I was born here. Yeah, you're probably never getting out of here, kid. Get a job and move out. People were saying that they saw a Pokemon flying high above Helen. Is it flying around all the time? Doesn't it need to rest somewhere? A shy po- oh, wait. A sky Pokemon! Where did you come from? Yes. Yes? Yes town? I've never heard of a place like that. Where did you come from? No. No? That doesn't make any sense. You have to come from somewhere. Oh wait. You're not gonna say you were born at the bottom of the sea, were ya? Okay. Weirdo. The Sky Pillar? Oh, you miss me in that tall, tall tower a little further out. If you ask me, I wouldn't climb it. It's too scary to get that up that high. Live at sea level and Pacific Log, that suits me fine. In the Hoenn region, there are three Pokemon that represent the power of rock, ice, and steel. Each of them is said to hide away deep inside caves. That's the story I heard when I was just a little kid. Six dots open three doors. Grandpa used to say that, but I don't know what he meant. Six dots- I'm writing that down. Six dots open three doors. I have no clue what that means, but I'm saving that for later. Finally, a Pokemon Center. Pacific Long Town floats on top of a colony of Horsla. If I told you that, would you believe me? I would have if you didn't make you... If you didn't make me... I can't talk. <laughs> what color is your trainer's card? Mine's copper. The ancestors of the people in Pacific Log were said to have been bored on boats and then lived and died aboard them. I understand that they lived that way because they were searching for something. I don't intend to be going nowhere fast in the sticks like this forever. Watch me. I'll get out to the city and become a huge hit. Seriously. I'm gonna cause a huge explosion of popularity. If you heard that, I'll happily teach explosion to your Pokemon. I'm good. Ah, 
You're turning me down because I live in the country? No, I don't want my Pokemon to fucking die. Okay, let's get out of here. I don't like this town. They're kind of freaking me out. I think I'm gonna go down the routes to the left. Explore a little bit. Route 132. A level 34 tentacle. Huh, I'm going in. Oh, hello. <laughs> Win or lose, you'll never know until you try. Hello, sir. Didn't mean to scare you like that. Fisherman Ronald would like to battle. He's got six Pokemon? Magic Arms. Classic, classic. He's gonna have like one crazy level Magikarp though. I mean, I keep on saying Magikarp. Gyarados. Fisherman Ronald is about to use Gyarados. Will I change? No. Does he have all Gyarados? A level 21. Oh, my attack is lowered. Ooh! No matter! Fisherman Ronald is about to use Gyarados. Yeah, he's gonna use Gyarados for every single one. A level 23 this time. Fisherman Ronald is about to use Gyarados. Will they change? No. Level 26 Gyarados. Fisherman Ronald is about to use another Gyarados. Will I change? No. A level 30. Still KOing. Fisherman Ronald for their final Pokemon is about to use Gyarados. Will I change? No. Level 35. So now a 9 level difference. That one didn't kill. Nice. You defeated Fisherman Ronald. Ah, I sank in defeat. You got 2,000 and 800 Pokemon Dollars for winning. Easy. So I guess no matter where you are in the whirlpools, you end up on this landmass. Oh, if you go in the in the top section, you miss it entirely. I lie. Oh. And if anything, if I take a wrong path from this whirlpool section, I can just teleport with Ralph back to the log city. I used to catch colds all the time as a kid, but I became totally fit after I started swimming. Okay. Fitness does not correlate with immunity, 
the child? That's not how it works. Swimmer Gilbert would like to battle. They sent out a Sharpedo. Oh wait, dark type uh switching. Oh wait, the bite doesn't hurt him that much. I forgot. Mikey grew to level 38. Four more levels till he's ready for the gym. You defeated Swimmer Gilbert. I crave more power. You got 544 Poké Dollars for winning. Oh, you can still move in some of the Whirlpool. You found one rare candy. You go! Nice. Oh, shoot, I'm back here. Oh, well, I gotta loop around and get this guy again. One star piece. Welcome. I've been expecting you. Are you a grocery stalker? Uh oh. Swimmer Linda would like to battle. They sent out a horsey, level 33. Horsey is poison water. I believe. Not poison. Swimmer Linda's about to use Cedra. Will I change? No. I don't want. Easy. You defeated Swimmer Linda. No, please! You got 528 Poké Dollars for winning. That was easy. You know what else is really easy? Subscribing. Because, guys, we are five hours in the stream, so it's time for me to run some ads. You can avoid that ad by subscribing for $4.99, just $5. Skip your coffee, get ad free viewing, almost on. Or, you can link your Amazon Prime to your Twitch account and hashtag sub for Fruit Prime. Click subscribe, see if you've got a sub available. And if you subscribe, you can kill my Pokemon. So, don't subscribe. Get some water, get a snack. I'll see some of you guys in a few. I'm gonna update my Pokemon list because I caught a Whale Lord. We're back in. Oh! Oh! Oh, I missed all those. <laughs>
Back in Sleepport. Okay. I'm gonna talk to the professor again. Or captain. Oh, Peason. Okay, so Team Aqua left before he could stop them. Oh no. Don't blame yourself. You're not responsible for this. Trying to catch the submarine is impossible for most people. You need a Pokemon that knows how to die. Perhaps if you went out to Moss Deep City. A lot of divers live out there, so someone might teach you. Oh. Okay. Noted. By the way, I'm gonna teleport back to the Log City? That way I can do the rapids again. Here we go again. After this encounter. I'm gonna try this lower path. They just won't leave me alone. Okay, so the way you end up on this landmass. I'm gonna go on the bottom. Ooh, that's a double battle. I like training here by myself. It's awful that all these people came. Says you. Cool trainer Darcy would like to battle. The Ascent of the Pelipper, level 33. Oh, really protect? Ralph grew to level 45. Cool trainer Darcy is about to use camera. Will I change? Uh, yeah. Magikarp, you're in. Level 33, camera. Imagine bringing a fire Pokemon to the ocean. That's so silly. You defeated Cool Trainer Darcy. Okay, I won't complain about other people being here. You got 3,160 Poké Dollars for winning. Now, where could my wife have gone? I'm always with her. I wonder if I could win on my own. I don't want to ruin your confidence, Gramps, but I don't think so. Expert Paxton would like to battle. They sent him to Swallow, level 33. Swallow has dark type moves, so I'm gonna switch to Blaziken. Why not? <laughs> oh wait, Swallow is flying! <laughs> wait! Dude, I can't keep making the same mistakes! Um... I'm switching. <laughs> Dude, I... It's because I see Blaziken as fire, okay? I keep forgetting he's fighting. He would use double team anyway. He could have killed, but it's fine.
Yo! Expert Paxton is about to use Breloom. Will I change? Yes. Breloom is poison grass. I think he's the mushroom guy. Yeah? Die. <laughs> you defeated expert Paxton. Ah, I see that I couldn't manage to win on my own after all. You got two thousand and you got two thousand six hundred and forty poker dollars for winning. Easy peasy and lemon squeezy. You found one protein. Someone's been watching me intently. Was it you? No. Cool trainer Jonathan would like to battle. They sent out a Kecleon. Kecleon has, by default, normal psychic and dark moves. So maybe a ghost would be strong? But you know what? Wait, Blaziken is weak to Psychic. Uh, my best bet is just to keep Ralph in, actually. Yup. Kutrin or Jonathan is about to use Loudred. Will I change? Yes. Loudred is normal, so Blaziken is powerful. Mikey grew to level 39. Three more levels, and he's ready for the gym. You defeated Cool Trainer Jonathan. Wow, that's pretty strong, all right. You got 3,168 Poké Dollars for winning. Easy peasy, lemon squeeze. Now let's go beat up this grandma. I'm always with my husband, but I can win even without him. Selene, she's confident. Let me destroy that. Expert Michaela would like to battle. They sent out a Rosalia. Rosalia is a Rosalia is poison grass, so confusion is gonna kill you. <laughs> Expert Michaela is about to use Medicham. Will I change? Medicham is psychic fighting. Yeah, I will not change, because I still have the advantage. We've never seen a meta jamming game. The sprite looks so cool. The shading on it was nice. You defeated expert Michaela. Oh, I guess I wasn't good enough. You got 2,640 Poké Dollars for winning. Easy. I'm gonna stay along the bottom. Oop. Uh. <laughs> I don't want a double battle. Did the currents carry you here too? This must have been faded. Let's battle. Swimmer Franklin would like to battle. He sent out a Celio. Ice water. Yeah, I'll keep Ralph in. Nice. That looks scary. Okay. We're good, we're good. Also, I got a mute. I got a mute.
I'm back in. My sister got the camera. Easy. You defeated Swimmer Franklin. Strong, too much so. You got 544 Poké Dollars for winning. I've led a life of woe and misery. I've been cast away and this is where I've drifted. Another? Poetry Slam Kid. Swimmer Debra would like to battle. <laughs> Sorry, the name Debra got me. A level 34 Sea King. You defeated swimmer Debra. Another loss. You got 544 Poké Dollars for winning. Ooh, Secreto. You've won one max revive. I have no need for that. Nothing here. Oh, man. Back in sleep port. Okay, not to better run. Okay, the teleport is actually huge. Ralph is my goat. So I probably have to do this two or three more times, and then I'll do the all- then I'll- I probably have to do this two or three more times, the way I get all the encounters. Yeah, I fought this guy already. And Sadio. I'm tempted to just use a repel, but this like still XP I'm gaining from these encounters, so it's whatever. Oh, I'm going up. made the same mistake. Damn. Oh, I missed them. <laughs> okay, I'm going the same path I did the first time. My 
my love disc is looking for a fun match. Will you join us? That looks like somebody's asking you to a fun night out. Swimmer Laura would like to battle the Ascent of the Love Disc, level 33. Swimmer Laurel is about to use Love Disc. Will I change? No. Why would I? I'm surprised I haven't fallen in love with the Love Disc. You defeated Swimmer Laurel. Oopsie! You got 520 Poké Dollies for winning. Even those Pokémon that can swim are carried along by the rapid currents. Swimmer Jack would like to battle the Ascent of the Gyarados, level 34. Switch into my own Gyarados. I'm gonna heal just to be safe. Oh, this is my last super potion. Uh oh. Ruh -roh. Oh, it still hit. Okay, good thing I healed. You defeated Swimmer Jack. <laughs> you got 544 Pokemon Dollies for winning. Andre's here. Yeah. I had not out to see yesterday. I've been hoping to find a new room to explore, but the tides somehow seem to carry me back where I started. I'm still weak at battling, too. Feel free to mock me, but I won't give up. My day will come when I discover a new ruin. That's all I have to say. Farewell for now. He's a masochist. What is he doing here? I'm gonna go down. My goal is to do all the fights here on this route. I think I have like four or six left. I've gotten most of them. Oh, back at Sleepport. You know what to do. Because having the teleport location be the, the log city is a huge dub. I think I'll stay in the center. Oh, 
Oh man, I missed this guy again. So I gotta stay further down. Miss the grandma again. Yeah, I gotta stay down down. So, middle down. Damn. Oh, wait. I can't walk back, damn it. Get back and sleep for it. No encounters, but it's okay. I know what I must do. Oh, hello. I want to win like everyone else, but I won't raise Pokemon like everyone else. What does that mean? Who cool Trainer Warren would like to battle? He is sent up to Graveler. Level 33. I'm switching to... Magikarp. Mainly because, like, I don't- I don't think Rock or Ground is strong against Ralph, but I'm still, like, concerned. Yeah, the earthquakes don't affect me, haha! <laughs> Mikey grew to level 42 more till he's ready for the gym. Cool Trainer Warren is about to use Ludicolo. Will it change? Ludicolo is dark slash water. I will not change because I don't want him to use Water Gun on my Blaziken. Oh, I could have tried Errand with this Pokemon. Uh-oh. Oh, that- okay. That was fine. As long as you don't do no, do no grass type move, I'm fine. Yo! Oh, this ludicolo is dumb. Stop absorbing. Insidio? I cannot believe you. I cannot. Yeah, I'm fine against Swift. If this bozo heals again. <laughs> you defeated Cool Trainer Warren. Darn it. My way is still too slack. You got 3,168 Poké Dollars for winning. I'm 
go for the lower path. Oh, nothing here. Oh, I remember this. Damn it. I had to go up. Yep, that's the end. After this encounter. I'll get it this time. Oh, I did it too high. I'm missing like all of them. I missed literally every encounter. Tartar cells. That's too high. In serio, such a wimp.
back here. I think I missed him. God damn it. Yep. I gotta find that sweet spot. I think it's this one. Then I go a little bit higher up. No, that's not right either. Say it, this is my least favorite type of puzzle in game because it's so hard to memorize. Oh, wait, no, 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 I'm too far up. I gotta go up here. And then further down. Okay, I, I almost got it. Guys, it's 4.20 p.m. lineup. If it's legal, of course. And serio. Can't even take one step. I'm gonna go down. Wait, what? You know, maybe I don't need this last guy. I know there's another encounter after him, but it's in the same path. Last try. I'm, I'm done with this section. I'm being honest. I'm done. Last try.
I got it. Yo, finally. I contemplate Pokemon 24 hours a day. How could you possibly beat me? Well, if you got fighting type and I have psychic type, which looking at you, you probably have a fighting type, don't you? Black Belt Kyo would like to battle. They sent out a Hariyama. Level 34. Watch this. <laughs> Better spend more time contemplating, huh? Six hundred and sixty nine XP? Yo. You defeated Black Belt Kill. I lose. I will concede defeat. You got two thousand one hundred and seventy six Pokedollies for winning. Yeah, that better be worth a lot, cause that took forever to find you, man. And I'm in. He's looking at me. Young people are too happy to go with the flow. They're with direct they're without direction. Expert Connor would like to battle. They sent out a chin chow. That is electric water. So Ralph is my best bet. Expert Connor is about to use Hariyama. Will I change? No! <laughs> you defeated Expert Connor. You have a firm sense of purpose. I did the regular man voice. You got 2,640 Poké Dollars for winning. I must have battled thousands of times. I've lost count. Expert Molly would like to battle. They sent out a witch with cash. He's got it. He's got a W on his forehead. Wait, he's cool. Like, he's just gotta be a fish, right? Yeah, he's just a fish. Ralph to level 46. Let's go. Expert Molly is but he's Metatite. Will I change? Metatite is fighting Psychic, so no, I will not change. You defeated Expert Molly. I may have lost thousands of times, but a loss still stings. You got 2,640 Poké Dollars for winning. You found one big pearl. Ooh! I can give that to my GF. Let's see. Big pearl. A lovely large pearl that will sell at a high price. Now I'm putting that on a ring for my GF. Or future GF, I would like to say. Now this is my last attempt. Yeah, I've fought that guy before. I think I've fought most everyone. I didn't get you guys. I came all the way out here with my bird Pokemon. Bird Keeper Bet would like to battle. This is the Tropius, level 34. Tropius is flying brass, so Ralph is neither strong nor weak. So a psychic should take it out. Oop. Oh, wait, what? <laughs> Stop it! A uh, quick attack. I'm fast. <laughs> I forgot this is what Whirlwind does. Easy. Mikey grew to level 41. One more level till he's ready for the gym. 
You defeated Bird Keeper Beck. You. You're stunningly cool. You got 2,176 Pokedollars for winning. Can't believe I convinced you to be a Poke Talker? No! I've only posted one TikTok Pokemon clip. No! And even. Okay, that best of compilation did not do that well. That Blaziken has been level 46 for two weeks? <laughs> what are you talking about? It's only day 15 of Peace Lock. What are you talking about? And don't be girling me. Oh, I haven't fought this guy yet. Guys, can we get some yos? Hi, Ethan. You caught me! Listen, have you seen another sailor around here? I don't think so? But I'm not gonna find your friend, sir. That's not my job. I'm a child. Sailor Hudson would like to battle. They sent out a Whalemer, level 34. Watch this. Easy. You defeated Sailor Hudson. Now that's something. You got 2,176 Pokedos for winning. Why is my Gardevoir a boy? I don't know. No say. But I'll... I will love them no matter what. I think... Oh, wait, how am I supposed to get that? Shit. Oh man. You know what? I said this was my last whirlpool attempt for the day, and I'm committing. If I don't get it, it's fine. It's surely it's nothing crazy. Because I still gotta pick my berries for the day, too. Catch any legendaries yet? No. I did catch a wave lord like randomly. I didn't even fish or dive for it. It was pretty sick, actually. Oh, just bring me back to the city, please. Repels exist? Dude, I know, but I'm, I'm just choosing to, like, be annoying. <laughs> also, all my repels I put in storage, and I keep forgetting to grab them. Okay, so I've done most of the encounters in the Whirlpool section. So, with my assumption, I've seen every single route on this map. Which is kind of wild. So to think... There's no more other trainer battles besides the ones I missed in the Route 132 to 134. I've battled most every trainer. I've seen most every random encounter Pokemon that I can. So that means for Moss Deep City and Sutopolis Gym, I probably have to level up in Routes 123. But I assume once I learn Dive, I'm going to go back to Moss Deep with the hint and learn Dive. There's probably like an underwater route to get to Sutopolis. So we'll discover that next time. So for now, I'm gonna go back and pick the rest of my berries and then we're gonna wrap for today, cause I'm hungry. Wait, I can break on my uh, bike now. <laughs> Oh yeah, I can also catch pick Pokemon with the fishing rod. Because I got the cool rod now. Okay, we're going to do the classic route going all around the map. So, how have you guys been doing? Now that we got the main meat and potatoes done for today. I had a dog named Trey. That's so cute. Did you name him after your tricycle? He had three legs. Honey, you can't be doing that shit. That's so mean. 
Okay, it is funny, but that's like genuinely like kind of like not cool. Like if the dog knew what that meant, I don't think he would like that. He'd probably like bite you or some shit. Don't laugh. You you set up that joke. You sent that in two chats. It's obviously a joke. You you're practicing your stand up in the chat room, and I don't appreciate it. Oh wait, none of my Pokemon know Smash. I know how to smash. Okay, so since we lost Nazzy, yes, I will send a purple heart. We're gonna teach Linus, my Linoon, all of the HMs to travel. But it's a true joke. <laughs> You know what? I bet you love telling that joke to see, like, everybody Google, and then their look of horror whenever you tell them that your dog had three legs. I'm moving Grambler. We don't really need Grambler. <laughs> Wait, Waylord's sprite is so big, he collides with the other sprites. <laughs> Linus, learn the rock smash. I also gotta teach him cut, too. You best not have been sending expletives in the chat room, Ethan. Clip farming? <laughs> Wait. Yeah, I'm kidding. It only sends asterisks whenever you send a link. Links are banned in my chat, but I look at clips whenever I end stream. But thank you for clipping. But yeah, if you're- if you want to become famous, you have to, like, ham it up for clips. You guys know this. Every single stream you do, you must have one banger joke. One good clip. And if I'm lucky, sometimes I'll have like two in a day. Oh yeah, I gotta make Magikarp my party leader whenever I go through these areas. So right now I'm gonna go and pick all the berries. I'm not gonna plant any berries, because I have a good handful of every single berry.
I almost bought Animal Crossing today. Really? I thought you had the game already, Ethan. <laughs> but I have to check if Fae Farm is better. I okay, I'll say it. I think Fae Farm is kind of uggy. It looks it's like trying too hard to be cute. I think it's ugly. Now, Fae Farm, if you want to sponsor me, um, I'm kidding. I think your game is very cute. Intentionally cute. I definitely think Fae Farm is, like, more of a game game, though. Animal Crossing is, like, there's a lot of nothing. I have yet to play Fae Farm. I've seen some gameplay and I've seen the trailers. But after playing Animal Crossing um, New Leaf on the Wii, it's literally Animal Crossing New Horizons, but like better. Like after like playing that version, Animal Crossing New Horizons is kind of mid. And um, Nintendo, if you're hearing me say this, um, I'm joking. Bay Farm sucks. And Fae Farm, if you hear me saying this, I'm joking, Animal Crossing sucks. <gasps> oh, Soul Rock? Ain't no way! Bite or Surf should kill. Yes, sir? Wait, imagine, like, Nintendo is watching. There's gotta be some, like, Nintendo- Nintendo executives that watch, like, Nintendo creators. And then the ones they hate, the copyright strike. <laughs> That's gotta be how it works. So, chat, we gotta stay on Nintendo's good side, okay? We can't be talking too much shit. And before Nintendo asks, I am playing on my GBA. Mm-hmm. Not on my computer. On my GBA. It's wild to think that I've seen every single route now. It's gonna take fucking forever to level up for the Elite Four, though. Shows the back of it, too. I just want to pick my berries, do a little bit of farming. Guys, we're almost at 100 hours. Isn't that crazy? <laughs> I'm not crying, you are. Serio? Estoy enojada. That means I am angry. Estoy enojado y tengo hambre. Yo quiero parar stream. <laughs> uh, I said I am angry and hungry. I want to end stream. <laughs> I don't know. Como se dice stream? No aprendí como se dice stream in Duolingo. Okay, I think Wednesday I want to do a Spanish stream. I want to try to do it. Do we have any Spanish speakers in chat? Type 1. Because I found a website where you can take like a, like a high school slash college level like Spanish exam.
And then of course I'll do Duolingo. You know what else is cool? Watching ads, because guys, we are six hours into stream. Isn't that crazy? So, if you want to avoid that ad, click subscribe to see if we got a Prime sub available. It's free. Hashtag sub for free with Prime. It's crazy. Do it now. Click subscribe. And if you don't have a Prime, if you tier one, you can kill my Pokemon. That's right. So don't subscribe. But also subscribe if you're a hate watcher. Get some water, get a snack. I'll see some of you guys in a few. I bet my clips go viral. Um, Ethan, you gotta get better at titling the clips. I will say that. I will say that. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> you haven't made enough clips for me to like determine if they're viral, if they're able to go viral or not. I know Twitch said they're launching, like, the new discoverability tab for mobile viewers, but I legit haven't seen it yet. Am I not part of the fucking beta? I almost said, I'm a beta male, why am I not in the Twitch beta? But, like, I'm not- I'm not male and I'm not a beta. I don't know why I would say that. <laughs> if anything, I'm a Chad. Imagine I get a C dot. Am I alpha? Yeah. Alpha. <laughs> oh, you're a Chad named Five Protein Powder Brands. How about I Uno Reverse, you name five protein powder bands, and you have to promise not to Google it. You gotta promise. Sad. Snazzy's dead. I'm sorry that I had to kill Snazzy, guys. I'm genuinely really sorry. But at this point in the game, I don't necessarily need a Pokemon to pick up items. I'm, like, so rich. I can just buy whatever I want. It's so nice being, like, middle class. You named two protein powder brands. I guess you're not a Chad. I would flex my arms, but I still got a gnarly bruise from when I donated plasma last week. The bruise is still fucking there. I don't want to show my arm on stream. The bruise is like almost gone now though. It's like a yellowy purple. <laughs> I was gonna say a joke, but I'm not gonna say it. I hate blood being drawn. I used to hate it a lot too. But you know, I have to get blood work every year basically. And when you do plasma, like the the needle is 
like two millimeters thick. It's a big ass needle. So like, I'm not phased after getting pricked anymore. Like vaccines, blood work. I'm like, oh, this is like nothing compared to the plasma needle. Like, holy shit. I'm running because I'm scared of electricity. I don't want to die. Like in real life too. Like the one time where I spilled water on my outlet, that was like genuinely so fucking scary. If you guys remember, it was about like a year and a half ago, I I comically spilled my whole water cup. It was a different cup because I broke the cup. I spilled the whole cup on on like my surge protector. So like the thing you plug into the wall to the wall that has like five different plugins. So I dropped water all over it. And the first thing you do whenever that happens is you unplug the the surge protector from the wall. And then you don't touch it. You don't touch it. And then you just cross your fingers that you don't fucking die when it fully dries. That's why make sure whenever you plug anything into the wall or a surge protector that is fully flush, the prongs are fully flush, into the outlet. That way no water can get in. Give us a reenactment? No, I'm not I'm not gonna farm clips that hard, okay? I want clout, but I don't want it that bad. I'm not gonna punch my setup like Kai Sinat or Queso, okay? I don't got the money to buy a new one. Unless you guys um give me some subs, then I'll do it. But my actually my surge protector is it's like across the room now, cause I, I got a surge protector with a with like a ten foot cable, cause my old one is only two feet, so I had to keep it closer to my setup. So like the closest outlet I have to my water my water cup is like four feet away. So like if I go like oh and then I knock it over, I'm fine. I'm literally fine. Okay, guys, I've done all my berries. We're back in Mauville City. So, oh wait, I gotta go to Moss Deep, huh? Okay, I'm gonna go swap out Pelipper. That way we can fly. And I'll, I'll spawn in Moss Deep City. That way, when we pick up tomorrow, we'll be right, ready to go. I can't fly inside the building? Okay, whatever. Fine. Fine. <laughs> okay, <laughs> there we go. I was struggling. To Moss Deep City! Now, let's save for today. 71 hours? Holy shit. Hi, <laughs> Diomio. Okay, the game has been saved. Live split timer is stopped. To recap! That is the end of day 15 of the Peace Lock 2024. Kind of a filler day, but also a crazy day. I figured out for the Moss Deep Gym. I need to get Dark and Ghost Pokemon. And if you missed it, or obviously if you're watching the YouTube video, I lost three Pokemon today because I went into a trainer battle only having one high level Pokemon. And honestly, because it was a, a Manectric against my Gyarados, I got really lucky. I genuinely got really fucking lucky that Gyarados didn't die after getting hit once or twice. So, Thank you, Pokemon Gods, for sparing me. Peace in underscore 17. Legit, if I would have lost the run at that point, I'm never playing this fucking game again. I think they heard my prayers in my head, and they gave me a dub. So, when we pick up next time, we have to focus on leveling up my Dark and Ghost Pokemon, which now I only have two. There. So, yeah. And then also I'm getting the Dive HM slash TM from Moss Deep. That way you can actually progress the lore. So, if you're new here, click subscribe if you're watching on YouTube. Guys, follow the channel, subscribe now. 
Okay, we're done. We're fucking done. I need to start saying subscribe in my outros, because I think it's really cringe whenever people put, like, the subscribe, like, graphic in their videos. I think that's really cringe. Also, hi, Alex. Can we get some yo's? Hello. Am I getting sick of the game yet? Um, I don't know. Dude, it's been 97 hours. 97 hours. Okay, does anybody want to do calligraphy? This is your final call. We've had nobody redeem. You guys got one minute. Because I'm hungry. I want to eat. I have mobile tofu in the fridge. And it sounds really good. Let's do... I like the Nintendogs music. Oh no, let's do the relaxing supermarket music. Man, I want to play Supermarket Simulator so bad. I'm itching. Pikachu color? Okay. I need to go buy chocolate. <laughs> Lol, so random. Roar XD. <laughs> yeah, everybody can see clips that are on my channel, but me, the streamer, okay. I can choose to delete them. I can change your guys' title. That way, if they're inappropriate. And then I can also choose to feature clips. So that means a featured clip gets pinned basically at the top of the clips feed. It's pretty cool. But sometimes if a clip gets zero views, then like it doesn't show up in the clips tab. So if you don't make a good clip, Twitch doesn't push it. Also, Twitch doesn't push clips if you don't change the the clip title as well, typically. I've noticed on um, clips where people keep the default title, so like the actual stream title as the clip title, it gets less views. <laughs> yeah, Alex doesn't need attention, and that's honestly really cool. Or maybe Alex clucks in at the end of stream because they know that I only talk to chat at this point of the stream. <laughs> okay, plan for the next few days. Tomorrow, continuing peace log. Leveling up. It's just the shadow on my knuckle. I thought I had a scratch. Continuing the peace lock tomorrow and then Wednesday, it will be a just chatting stream. It'll either be the rad spectrum quiz stream or Spanish stream, which honestly either sounds really fun. What's this or what's the quiz? There's a few like fun ones, and then there's all I found this one like high school slash college level like Spanish comprehension quiz. So like something that you would take for like the um like the AP Spanish quiz. I gotta double check the website. That sounds difficult. You know what? I got a four on my AP Spanish exam. I did pretty fucking good, so. But granted, I think the AP exam was, like, easy. Because, like, it wasn't as hard as, like, the English, like, grade 12 AP English exam. It felt like in, it felt like an English exam for, like, a, for, like, a 10th grader. Like, it felt like it was two grades below than what I should have been. Yeah, we had AP Spanish, but in order to take AP Spanish, you had it was your fourth year of Spanish. So, because when I was in junior high and then high school, when I was in ninth grade, that was when they started offering Spanish to the ninth graders. But now they offer um, second languages or foreign languages to like seventh and eighth graders now. It's pretty cool. 
So like a lot of kids in my district, or I guess my old district because I moved. Yeah, my old district. They can learn EL or sorry, they can learn um ASL, they can learn Spanish in like seventh grade now. And then they can learn French and there's one more language. They can learn French and then another language once they reach high school. It's because it's required to have at least two years of a foreign language in order to graduate from my district or my old district. I don't know about my local district now, though. Because obviously I'm not a fucking school, so I don't know. But the only thing that sucks about... If you have to take a language in school, is that it counts as your elective. So, like, if you want to take art, well, now you can't because you gotta take Spanish. Which, that is honestly a huge L. There's not enough time in the day, it seems. That's silly? Yeah. They're always gonna be cutting funding for the arts because the censorship of art is fascism, and they love fascism. <laughs> okay, I would like to say this is a different shade of yellow. This is neon, but this is like a golden rod. It just doesn't show up on camera. Yellow is so bright. Yeah, it's because my color correction for this camera, I add a bit more blue hue. So it makes yellows and oranges look more bright because of contrast more. You guys, I'm done. I'm tired. I'm hungry. But that was day 15 of the Peace Lock 2024. Guys, surely, when we continue, I will... Uh, beat all the gyms yes sir well honestly for the moss dupe gym i need to be 42 for the Sutopolis gym i need to be 46 so i'm i'm thinking maybe three to four more days of peace long it's either gonna be three to five days it depends on how quickly i'm able to level but yeah thank you guys for watching any chatter slippers thank you for hanging out I will see you guys again tomorrow. It'll probably be like... It'll either be like... It'll be between 9 and 11 tomorrow. Because I might have to do shit in the morning. But I'll see. Peace luck tomorrow. Just chatting stream on Wednesday. Thursday? I might stream. I'm not sure. Friday sub only. You know the drill. And I should be able to stream this weekend. So... We'll see. Dude, somebody's cooking something. And it smells like it's burning. Dude, I can't trust the roommates. They're both off today. They're probably making pizza or some shit. Dude, pizza sounds so good, actually. I might make myself pizza. <laughs> um, yeah, birthday stream is next Wednesday. About a week away, guys. So, Oilers, hold. <laughs> I, I have the birthday stream just about fully planned out, so. It'll be a banger. Dude, 12-hour stream? That's nothing compared to the peace loss. Okay. Thank you for watching. If you want something to watch right now, new YouTube video. It is all my top Twitch tips on how to be an epic streamer. So go watch the video right now. And if you aren't already, make sure you're subscribed to my YouTube channels. I have the main channel for stream highlights every week, and then the clip channel for daily YouTube shorts. The command is not working, but it's youtube.com slash at peace in 17 and youtube.com slash at peace in 17 clips. Make sure you subscribe to both. Okay. I'll see y'all tomorrow. Goodbye. You know what's funny? About the Twitch Tips YouTube video? It's gotten like 50% dislikes. <laughs> Which is really funny. Because like, I literally have sarcasm tagged in the title. Or in the description. So like, it's really fucking funny. <laughs> like, Okay, honestly, like, I was clickbaiting a little bit. 
but that's why I made sure to because like when you put a tag in the description on a YouTube video it shows up on like in subtle gray text under the title so like it's like the second thing people see so like if you clicked on the video thinking it was real you're done <laughs> or if you clicked on it watched it for like a minute and you didn't see the sarcasm tag you're doing I'll say it but yeah I find that really interesting it's not often I do parody stuff but I thought it was really fun what is this Ludwig ass music Do -do -do -do. Oh, wait guys your tax returns are due today make sure you do it and if you don't um file an extension you'll get in trouble okay this is your final minute any final words bye alex thanks for hanging out bye go bobo we'll see you later Dude, my Instagram reels have been doing so well. Like, most every single one of my reels gets like a thousand views now. It's crazy. Okay, bye guys.